Account. So, welcome everyone! Welcome this week, uh, David Castro, Pumpkin Fights, Blindful, uh, someone stopping from farming. Welcome Zionis, uh, Zeris, uh, Pumpkin Fights, uh, Afri, Commissar, yeah, we are farming, we are farming, Commissar. Welcome Priel, welcome uh, uh, Holy Predazor, Crayade. Hope I pronounced it correctly. Pistachios, uh, Capybara, Saiva Lord of Bones, uh, Gabe, uh, Mondo Cane. <laughs> <laughs> that name is it's really it's really interesting, especially in Italian. Face of Mercy, welcome everyone, guys. All right, are you gonna try now to get ending A? Now that we know it's possible, uh, no, Afri, because uh, it's possible with a glitch. I'm gonna try to avoid as much as possible using glitches. That that's why I don't want to do to go for ending A. I get to relax watching now, <laughs> I don't have to do this nightmare anymore. You're gonna see Dark Raccoon, we are gonna do it. This is how to complete Olivia Wilcherless in the Fapolo way. So I'm just farming here in the sewers with this little fella. He cannot come over here because there is an invisible wall, so I'm safe regardless. Purple, is it true that the, what they were saying about you on Discord voice chat? What, what were they saying, Heiko? Uh, tell me. I have no idea about what were they saying, actually. I wasn't present, so... It's not a glitch you can with a fe with a feature. We will think about it. Uh, today is gonna be dedicated to ending B, but uh, after that, uh, maybe you can explain me how. Uh, contractually obligated to start every stream with an ASMR. No, I just like doing that, uh, Vitor. I actually just like doing that, otherwise I wouldn't do it. Sorry if we start uh, uh, immediately, but I have a big plan for everything. A big plan for everything, I mean. The plan is mostly gonna be Hopefully we don't get low rolls and only get the good rolls. Potentially, it's basically what he, what is needed for today's for today's run. We need good rolls. Also, uh, I got a, a, an interesting thing to say. As you can see, I was able to obtain four Ratkin head from Pinecone Pig farming. One Pinecone Pig, one Ratkin head is zero point six percent. So, 4 Ratkin head is like uh, uh, 0.6 uh, uh, times 0.6 uh, times 0.6 uh, times 0.6. Uh, it's crazily low. And we got that. <laughs> Joe Propolo, come stai? Welcome, Fenrir. I'm, I'm well today. How are you? Free Soulstone. Exactly. Free Soulstone. And also, we are gonna get. Uh, we're gonna use uh, a murky vial on the little kids inside of the orphanage. Because they could be able to give us more stuff. And thank you so much for the follow, Boundless729. Thank you so much, my friend. Alright. Also, I, I'm uh, I'm not forgetting, uh, uh, I left behind 10 shillings instead of uh, of the, the cash of the shop. So if we have uh, 80, we're only missing 9 shillings, then we are good. Also, I want you to see I have 99 turnips. Are you happy now? And Zionis, uh, thank you so much for renewing your membership. Now, unfortunately, you have Ragnavaldor near your name. I'm sorry. I didn't want to put Ragnavaldor there, but uh, a, a, a pet is a is a like a uh, a bat is a bat. You change the guard badge with the Lagar with the Ragnavaldor. Yes, Zionis. Uh, <laughs> during a stream, <laughs> someone someone was saying uh, put Ragnavaldor as the 
badge for uh, two months of membership or something. And I said, okay, let's do some mar marketing. If someone donates five, $50, I'm gonna change it. Because I thought no one was gonna donate $50, you know? Then someone did donate $50, and of course I lost. <laughs> of course you wanted to put Dragon Valdo. We'll know you love him. No. He's the worst character in the world. And uh, Matthew Hale! Thank you so much for gifting five memberships to the chat. Jesus! <laughs> Welcome, by the way, Matthew Hale. Jesus, we just started. Also, wait, ah, ah! I almost killed my microphone. <laughs> I had it, uh, uh, like, the, the the cable of the microphone was uh, around my knee. I moved my knee, it was almost falling down. <laughs> Thank you so much, Matthew Hale, really. Thank you so much, my friend. Now everyone in the chat is green, finally. <laughs> I love this. You didn't say hey enough, you'll be executed later. Uh, hey? I, di I didn't say hey? What do you mean I didn't say hey? <laughs> Thank you so much, Matthew Hale, really. Alright, also guys remember, in order to receive uh, the gifts uh, from the, the chat, you have to enable the possibility. I think it's in a setting uh, in the chat himself. You're farming up again, that is so surprising. Welcome, Gecko! Yeah, we are farming! We are farming because today I'm not playing around- Oh, oh, I opened a start menu. Okay. Today I'm not playing around. Today we are gonna win. I have freaking 81 shillings, so... Let me explain- let me explain the plan. Once we get the hardened heart, uh, we cannot lose against Father Hugo, whatsoever. You foolishly thought uh, no one would donate $50 to prove a point in your streams? Uh, shoot, I would give you 100 for a coin flip <laughs> 100! Calm down, Gabe. Gabe, calm down, calm down. I love your company, there is no need to, really. <laughs> but that may be a good idea. Hmm, we will see. Oh, farming music, right? I forgot. Sorry, sorry. Uh, farming music. Today we go with the Queen. Advertisement, no worries, random meme. This is gonna be farming until I get eight more shillings. After that, uh, uh, yeah, Karas. Uh, Ring of Braids could be useful, but I don't know how does the Ouija board work, so I guess I'm gonna skip that. It's not required because uh, I really have a plan for it. Also, we are gonna go back to the church because I want to use the sigil of Grogroth on the ground. We need the necromancy for this. It's not, not we need necromancy, but uh, in order to do what I want to do, I feel more safe uh, having necromancy. Because uh, there is the possibility we will have to fa <laughs> The Odyss! <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> okay, let, let me <laughs> drink a second. <sighs> God damn it! <laughs> Zeanis, uh, thank you so much for the 50 dollars, my friend! Uh, of course, the Queen of Hatred for the six months, of course, my friend! I'm gonna screenshot the comment, uh, uh, so I don't forget, but... Uh, Jesus! <laughs> Jesus, thank you so much, Zeanis! I, 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 ac I accept, because... Uh, both, I love Queen of Hatred, uh, and, uh, like, uh, I like this idea of putting it for the six months, uh, because, uh, Lobotomy Corporation deserves, uh, some place in the chat. Thank you so much, Zionis. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I really appreciate it, Zionis, really. I'm pulling out my credit card. No! Gabe, come down, come down! <laughs> Gabe's dog has awoken. <laughs> uh, this is old PC, yeah. The guy that is responsible for making my PC today didn't answer my phone. Literally. I called him two times at, at different intervals. And uh, if tomorrow he doesn't answer anymore, I'm just gonna buy a pre-made PC, I swear. But I think he's gonna answer tomorrow. Also because uh, I could also just directly... Since tomorrow I'm, uh, I'm uh, completely free, I don't have to go to Uni. I can literally walk to his shop. Literally. So I don't have any problems, let us hope. No, he didn't die, Afri. To I can literally walk to his shop, it's like five minutes uh, uh, on foot from here. Today I couldn't because I, I was busy with university. But I swear, if tomorrow he doesn't say anything uh, on the morning, I'm gonna go to his uh, uh, office in the afternoon. PC guy got moon scorched. <laughs> Imagine. Imagine I enter the office, I have to start a battle against him, and I get, I don't know, the... 
What what soul could you have? What soul does uh, uh, Olivia's sister has? Uh, I don't remember. Your old PC killed him out of jealousy. My old PC is the one that I'm currently using, so it's possible. It's absolutely possible. Never mind, I forgot my wallet in my jacket in my school. Oh, huh? In my wallet in my jacket in my school. You left your jacket at school, Gabe, really? Hmm. I didn't know that was a thing uh, abroad. But we will see. Alright, how are we? Oh, radiating soul. Okay, so he's probably gonna have the radiating soul. Come on. Only six more shillings and we are good. Also, guys, uh, from here, I think we can access the, the church from here. Can you guys confirm me? From this uh, small alley with the infected people, we have access to the the room with the, um, the puzzle that, that connects to Moonless, right? If that's the case, I can go directly there from here. And then we go to the orphanage. What do you mean with the... Uh, that wasn't a, a thing abroad. Because uh, here in Italy, Gecko, in sc you don't you don't leave uh, jackets as at school. That's what I mean. Like uh, abroad for me is outside uh, of outside of Italy. Like here, it isn't uh, a good uh, a normal uh, people isn't used to leaving jackets at school. That's what I'm saying. No, I'm not using an auto click a random meme. I I just memorized the combo because I'm doing it for like uh, I've been doing it for like uh, two hours. <laughs> So, I already know where I have to click, I can just look at the chat. Also, I don't know how to set up an auto-click. In the very far past, when I was playing Minecraft or something, and I was playing on servers, I tried to set up an auto-clicker. But I wasn't able to, and in the end I just stopped it. I just stopped it, literally. It was uh, way faster just working myself than uh, setting up an auto-clicker. Propod already has a muscle memory for farming. Exactly, I mean, it's uh, literally uh, two buttons. Uh, three, sorry, three. I have to click uh, uh, X, uh, wait, uh, X, uh, down, Z. Three buttons farming, uh, three buttons muscle memory. I have a speedrun strat for where I want to f to, f to speedrun uh, uh, Pinecone Percent uh, on uh, Fear Nanger 2 Termina. Please, Dark Raccoon, make on the speedrun.com a category named Pinecone Pink Percent where you have to get all the items that Pinecone Pink drops at 99 quantity, please. But anyways, there is more than one Po in Termina. Yeah, Karas, actually, yeah. There is one Po uh, at, at each radio, radio, if I remember correctly, and also at each TV. When a grown man whispers in my ear. Like this, you mean? No, it's not gonna be so long, uh, Holy Predator. Like a... Uh, uh, oh, wait, uh, wait. Uh, <laughs> the Rodkin head! <laughs> is a 0.6%. <laughs> that means... Uh, Getting 100 wrecked king ads uh, is gonna require, I, I think, more than one full day. Potentially two. <laughs> that's, uh, that's strange, I'm studying electrical engineering and we can't leave our jackets in school or in our classes since we get one class and we have to go to different classes for lectures. Oh, you can. Like, uh, that's strange. Uh, like, uh, here, usually, if you leave something behind, it gets stolen. Like. Uh, uh, literally, I was studying uh, at one of my friend's universities. Okay, I left the charger inside of the inside of the the place. I went away for uh, like 30 minutes because we were a little bit outside. My friends were smoking or something, uh, and I just wanted the company. When I came back, the charger was disappeared completely. Fortunately, I had another charger for the for the phone. Uh, otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to charge uh, at all until I bought a new one. What is the Red King head for? They are for getting new soul stones. For getting new soul stones, re really. Purple was living in Romania all along. <laughs> Why? Do, do uh, 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 people in Romania steal stuff or something? Can't have shit in Italian school. Yeah, exactly. If you leave something behind, it's either gonna be broken when you find it again, or be stolen completely. 84, we're only missing 5. Jesus. Trap is in Detroit. <laughs> no wonder you love the phrase, opportunity makes man a thief. Like, uh, I've never stolen something, uh, except maybe, you know, when you were very young, maybe you stole a toy from one of your uh, uh, friends in the in the asylum. Uh, no, wait, it's not asylum. How is it called? The one before school. But still, I returned it afterwards because I felt very bad. I knew Italian had a mafia, but I didn't know Italians have Roman descent. <laughs> <laughs> is asylum the correct term for uh, the place? No, not asylum, damn, I used the incorrect term. 
Can't watch because I don't want to spoil Termina, but love like, like your leave, blah, leave your content, keep it up, bruh. Thank you so much, Oatmeal0001, my friend. Thank you so much for the five dollars. I really appreciate it. See ya. I hope once you get uh, all the informations on Termina, you're gonna watch back this. Thank you so much, Oatmeal, really. No, let me let me explain uh, oh kindergarten, that's why, okay. Let me explain why I, otherwise I seem stupid. So, in Italian, the word for kindergarten is asilo. And since I played Dark Souls and I know the word asylum, my brain instantly thought, oh yeah, asilo in English is asylum. <laughs> That's what happened. Uh, live chat reminder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks, uh, Blindful. I already said it. Uh, no worries. That's why I, I confused the kindergarten and asylum because... Uh, Asilo is very similar to Asylum. That's uh, <laughs> that's why. I'm sorry. I mean, also I played the kindergarten, the, the game of Kindergarten in the past, so I guess maybe I should have remembered, but uh, whatever. So yeah, I mean, everyone, I think uh, every one of us, uh, each one of us, uh, when was in Kindergarten, stole something. Uh, maybe they returned also, but uh, but still, Dark Souls Kindergarten. <laughs> It's probably old cap. He said asylum because he's an eldritch god who has to be suppressed. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Imagine being an eldritch god. Did you beat the second kindergarten game? No, never played that one, random meme. Never played that one. Only the first one. Uh, and uh, I think I didn't even finish it. I think I didn't even finish it, actually. But I may go back to it. I love the pixel art style, that kind of stuff. Uh, and even the time-based mechanic or something. Uh, you know, that game would really enjoy having a fishing minigame. Did you beat someone in kindergarten in a 1v1? <laughs> there is actually a story about the kindergarten, but I don't know if I should tell it. <laughs> so, let me explain, okay? During the recreation in kindergarten, we had this big open space inside of the, of the school itself. And, uh, and there were these uh, machines, uh, literally, uh, machines in which you, these, these little toy cars uh, and you were able to enter inside of them uh, and with your feet uh, you were able to move like a normal car, okay? <laughs> Frap killed a man in kindergarten. Uh, you're gonna see, you're gonna see. <laughs> and uh, when I was very little, I loved playing with these cars, okay? So what happened is one day, one of my friends <laughs> was entering inside of the car but wasn't still inside, okay? So I thought uh, it would be a good idea to jump scare him uh, with the, the car and stopping right before it but you know... I didn't know physics. I didn't know physics, literally and so I didn't know I would have needed a bigger strength in order to stop the car before hitting him So... I, I smashed him against my car, but he was fine. He was fine. He, he only had uh, a big red thing on the on the chin and we and we are still great friends. So <laughs> So it was fine. I didn't do it on purpose. It was the it was the um, it was me being uh, innocent and not knowing what to do. <laughs> That is called an accident, but they, they were toy cars, they weren't like uh, uh, in metal or something, they were made of like plastic. They didn't do a lot of damage to you, but uh, still, uh, he was fine, he didn't have any problems, and now we are still friends. No, we are still friends, the pumpkin fights, we are still friends! <laughs> I was in the kindergarten, guys, I, I'm sure, guys, don't, don't trick me. I'm sure you guys did even worse potentially than this when you were in kindergarten. Na 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 na. <laughs> I was a little I, was, I, I had like a three years or three years or, or something, four years. But still, I remember in the good old days when I was a very very rude little boy. I used to steal children's toys, toys that had some sort of sword or knife. I would break them off and steal the swords. <laughs> you know, I remember something similar, but it was with my own toys. Because when I was very younger, I just wanted to play with the sword itself, instead of the, the guy with the sword. But still, let's stop talking about the guy that I <laughs> that I <laughs> that I hate with the car. He is fine, no worries. He's completely fine. Otherwise, uh, I wouldn't be here now. Like, uh, I think if you do something like that, once you uh, become uh, uh, 18, you would be taken to I don't know uh, a sort of uh, how is it called in English? Uh, like, oh, Ratkinad! Another Ratkinad! Yes! Uh, 
How many years till we finish farming and get on with the challenge? Uh, I think uh, 10 minutes, uh, Dark Raccoon. I need like two more shillings. Uh, so I think 10 minutes is gonna be enough. Uh, for Polo Fanboy? No. What do you mean, Fanboy? Why Fanboy? What did I say? <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> did I say something misunderstandable? Uh, no, I'm not a Fanboy. What do you mean? Whatever. You guys are just tricky. You guys are gaslighting me. <gasps> shilling! How many shilling? How many shilling? Let me see. We are missing one. A single one. Who else have you killed? Um, <laughs> no one else. <laughs> I didn't kill that one in the kindergarten, by the way. I'm not a fanboy guy. <laughs> Why are you suddenly say fanboy, guys? <laughs> Unfortunately, Frappy is not in. Oh, shilling! Okay, we're over. It's over. It's over. Okay. Now. Uh, stop the music, stop the music, guys. We can actually play the game after 2 hours and 20 minutes. Did you kill somebody in school? No, holy predation. <laughs> I didn't kill, no. I didn't kill anyone. I swear. <laughs> Alright, so. I think uh, it's easier to reach the church from here. I have to juke the infected people, but it should be fine. Even if I die, we didn't farm a lot, right? It was just like two hours or something. I guess we're fine. We are totally fine. I would give the toys back and uh, act. Uh, ah! Uh, dumbfounded as if it was. Uh, I, won't, I was mentally challenged uh, and every goddamn time it worked eventually. <laughs> I had a pile of toys worth to this day. I have no idea how to, how to repent. I mean, it's fine. It's fine, if you are a ch if you are a child, you cannot do anything about it. Uh, did you start the stream uh, a hour earlier? No, but I farmed uh, off camera. This is literally the Minecraft YouTuber that says, uh, Hey guys, I did a little bit of farming off camera. Uh oh. Uh oh. I guess we can talk, right? Uh, wait. Uh. No, it's not over. We can talk to one. I think it's this one. Okay. Let's talk. Uh. So, uh, I have to say, stay back. Uh, no, ignore it. Uh, ignore it, I guess. Uh, yeah, I have 20 agility, but they are two. Okay, ignore it. Uh, I have to say, ignore it, right? Uh, tell me, guys, I have to say, ignore it. Uh, correct? Uh, tell me, um, tell me it's correct. Yes, okay. Okay, and then this is a bluff. Uh, no! I swear if I die here... <clears throat> so let's let's calm down. <laughs> uh, yes, uh, yes, guys. No, no worries, no worries. I have a, I have a plan. I, I I got this. I got this. You know what is the plan? Let me let me let me let me show you. Let me let me enlighten you, buddy. We are gonna we are gonna de be defeat Father Hugo with RNG. Uh, do we have a, a murky vial? I do have a murky vial. Perfect. New plan, guys. Let me explain. Let me explain, guys. New plan. We are gonna defeat Father Hugo using RNG. After that, we are gonna literally get necromancy and uh, RNG everything. Literally. Uh, 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 uh. No worries, no worries. I'm fine, I'm fine. No worries. It happens, guys. I was dumb. I was dumb for uh, not, uh, not, uh, not being careful about what I did. It was my own fault, so no problem. No problem. Hey, it's fine, guys. For you, the stream started 24 minutes ago. For me, it started like 2 hours and 24 minutes ago, but uh, I guess we cannot have everything in our life, so no worries, guys. Yeah, 2 hours and a half of farming gun, but no worries, no worries. I'm pretty chill in this moment because uh, even if I don't have the Ardent Heart, I still think I should be able to do it. Or I could just cheat in uh, 99 shillings, but I guess no. No. I'm not gonna cheat in 99 shillings at this point. Uh, nah. This messes up my plan. I had a big plan for defeating Sir Gull, 
and now it's gone. I think I can steal a freaking uh, hardened heart from uh, Moon Scorched Marco. The problem is I don't know if I'm able to. G g guys, uh, actually, hmm, I have a plan. Can I can I escape from Marco Battle? If I can f escape from Marco Battle, I could literally. But uh, uh, I have I still need to have the. Um, uh, Caligura soul, I think it is, to get steel, but whatever. Uh, yeah, it's because the farming was supposed to be made in live. I don't think that's the reason I died, but still. I think we can consider it like that, so we're gonna feel happier. We're gonna feel way... or, or at least we're not gonna feel bad. No worries, guys! I got this! Marcus in a cage, like Jojo. So, I have to interact with him. Karen gives steel... Karin gives steel. Hmm... I mean, uh, no, I'm not gonna be able to defeat Karin like this. Whatever, guys. No worries, guys. No worries. I'm chill. I'm chill. We just have to go. And and uh, we're gonna attempt to kill um, Father Hugo with RNG. I think at this point is objectively the best thing to do. Hmm. I only have one heal, though. The, the real problem is the heal. Like, uh, before I had, like, 18 uh, red herbs and blue herbs. Hmm. That is a problem. But still, we are not losing our uh, patience. Otherwise, we are gonna play <laughs> way worse. This means the bug fix stream is getting postponed. No! No! We are gonna do both. We are gonna see. I, I have to re-elaborate this in my mind, but uh, no problem. I still got this. See? Blue Vial! If I'm able to get uh, something uh, like Alchemilla Volume 3 or something from the, the, the Orphanage, I should be fine. Uh, and the shieldings, good. We have our second small things amulet. P Pine Phobia because of Frapo. <laughs> Pine Phobia, the fear of the Pine Comp Pig. Every time the Pine Comp Pig enters in battle, you take 50 mind damage. Okay, see, we're getting some shieldings. Uh, we are chilling, we are chilling, we are getting some shieldings. Uh, that's a good, uh, that's a good song. We're chilling, we're chilling, we're getting some shillings. Uh, give me a freaking Book of Enlightenment. Come on! Uh, bro? Okay. Okay, Rare! Rare is not bad. I could use Rare, actually, because there is a place uh, near the, the starting train. I can get one level of affinity with him. Also, let's, let's get something here, please. Uh, please? Come on, something good. Sorry, I didn't precise. Now... <sighs> pig phobia, every time you see a pinecom pig, you get a heart attack in real life. <laughs> no worries, Commissar, I'm not dead inside. I'm gonna recover in the span of uh, 10 minutes, uh, because uh, two hours farming lost like that is a little bit too much even for me, but still, but still. That means we have to RNG Father Hugo. After that, uh, it's gonna be way easier. Stupid hardened heart. Uh. Now, small things amulet, we have 100% per escape ratio. I swear that 0 0.6 drop was a bad omen. <laughs> I, I don't know, maybe I was just making a mistake because I thought uh, I was uh, resistant to that damage. I think that was my real mistake. Uh, like, uh, I wasn't expecting him to deal. <gasps> Four shillings! Uh, guys, uh, there is the possibility we don't even need to farm. There is a possibility. A little possibility, you know? No, there is no possibility, but still. From patience is respectable, but that but it has a limit. Exactly. I have a, a high patience, uh, but even I can become mad. But for now, I'm not mad. Didn't you lose around four hours of farming uh, in your rag as item only as run? That's why I'm not completely angry, because uh, I, I already have experience of losing uh, hours of progresses. Uh, and there, I was a little bit sad. But now, I'm, uh, I'm resisting. Shillings! Uh, see? See? We already have 15 shillings, we only need, uh, um, um, 84. <clears throat> but still, we're only missing 84 shillings, guys. Uh, <laughs> hmm. I'm not mad, Gekko, what do you mean? If I was mad, I would have answered you in a completely different tone. In this moment, I'm pretty chill. Okay, we have to juke the death mask to, be to go back inside of the, the orphanage. Chad, fear, and anger, enjoy. <laughs> Also, I'm gonna wait here to be sure I don't get soft locked like it happened previously. And now we're fine. Rare is res has been reset. 
And if only I was, I was able to get Alchemilia Volume 3, I could be able to, fa to fight Father Hugo without problems, so come on. Now we just have to... No, I'm not gonna suppress it, what do you mean? <laughs> We're finally getting out of Prehevil with 15 shieldings, so yeah, I imagine. Oh! You stupid, uh, stupid! No, no, no! There's... If you're not if you're not mad, why do you sound so mad? I'm not mad. I'm not. If I sound uh, so mad, I'm sorry. It's not. Uh, it's not what I, what I am. Uh, thank you so much for the follow, Villa Valle. Thank you so much, my friend. If your brother was mad, he would turn evil and be like, uh, "You guys aren't funny." <laughs> yeah, I would probably do something like that. Uh, I think. Uh, no, I don't. I don't think I would do that. Like, uh, I don't think I would uh, attack the chat. <gasps> oh, oh. Mm -mm. Come on. I don't think I would attack the chat even if I was really mad. As I went to for an A for Olivia Colonia was without saving for four hours. <laughs> four hours, that's bad. Alright. I lost 20, exactly, no, not 20 mind, I lost uh, 30 mind. 30 mind seems uh, uh, good enough for this situation. So, Mahavre, come on. If we can get either a Book of Enlightenment here or Alchemilia Volume 3, I'm gonna be so happy. If I get Alchemilia, I am gonna freaking go- Oh, Shillings! Shillings, guys! We are getting somewhere. We are getting some <laughs> If you're not mad, then why? Uh, why are you perfectly normal and level-headed? Uh, because uh, that's how I react. He lost 30, but uh, he started with 10, exactly. I mean, no, no, wait, no! <laughs> Come on. The loot of the cabinets at school, they are always static. Wait, you mean they're always the same? So I'm always gonna get the same things from the loot of the, the school? Hmm. Interesting. I didn't know that. That's potentially useful. Potentially useful. Then, uh, I guess, uh, Book of Fears. Uh, nah. Not what I wanted, but I guess I guess that's fine. Now, I really want to open all the possible bookshelves because I want to be sure there is a book of enlightenment in here. Also, I will need to farm at some point now because uh, I need uh, a second murky vial to be able to defeat uh, the the sheriffs that block the way. Also, let's go up here. Hello there. Are you? Ch oh, Chew. And there is Levi. I I hear Levi crying. No worries, we are- I've got this. I've got this. I've got this, guys. Maybe today is not the finale, but it's gonna be very close to the finale. Oh no, there is another one! <laughs> no! <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, you, you know what? Screw this. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. I don't care about seeing what's up there. Whatever. Now, we still have a uh, 20, 20 uh, escape chance, but I, if I get st stuck by two people, it's hard. And I get a moldy bread, that's good. Hmm? No, bro, you're not supposed to be up here. Goodbye. I wanted to open that, that other one thing, but I guess uh, it's better to escape and to be safe. Now, there is a Po up here. If they don't see me, I can actually take the, the stuff and the chest, which potentially may be a Ring of Braids, which may be useful. Give Frapoldo stream. <laughs> Where is the Poe? Poe? Where are- Oh, Ornament Lantern, that's good. Oh, there it is, the Poe. So we have four shieldings. That's, for now, a good ratio. Artificial Soul, that's uh, whatever. Then... Egg, blue herb. If I go down, I'm gonna get uh, blocked. If I go down, I have to juke him. Come on. Stop following me, please. He doesn't fo He doesn't stop follow- Oh, okay, okay! It's time! Arm guards! That's good! Arm guards are fantastic! If you're able to do this, arm guards are fantastic. Hmm. Okay. Now, Poe is not a problem because I have 100% escape. Uh, let's... How Olivia can escape from battle? I have two small things amulet, my friend. With two small things amulet, you have 20 agility. Using the battle menu uh, escape, you have 100% chance of escaping if you have one party member that, and that party member has 20 agility. That's how it works. Let me drink a little bit. 
You didn't censor Poe's face. The face is not a problem. <laughs> me. All right. Now, here we are. Let's take more stuff from here. Uh, nothing. Uh, cloth fragment. Uh, uh, whatever. Random. Lavender. Then nothing. Nothing. Random. Uh, if they are fixed, then during a speedrun you could like uh, already know the ones you have to pick or something. That could be interesting, but whatever. Also, I have to eat. Uh, yeah. I do have to eat in this moment. And just to be sure, I have a plan in order to deal with Father Hugo even if we don't get lucky with the Alchemilia or something. Ah! Stupid kid. Can you move? Okay. <laughs> lavender! Weird thing earlier with the Lavender in the Overworld. What's that, uh, Priya? Tell me. Okay, here we are. Now. What can we do here? I think there should be more, more bookshelves. And for the love of god- oh, 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 closed? Does this one need the headmaster key or something? Machine just turned 144p. Oh, oh, is that a problem for uh, from my part or yours? Uh, oh, oh. Is it fine, guy? Okay, good now. Okay, uh, I don't know. I don't know why that happened, actually. It's fixed for me. Apollo's uh, Apollo way of saying skill issue. What? Uh, what did I say for saying skill issue? Tell me, Gecko. And uh, there is another kid. Uh, I mean, uh, we are gonna have to farm at some point because I need golden chanterelle. Jesus, I had like 16 golden chanterelle previously. <laughs> Whatever, we don't think about the past. Okay, so. Uh, no, I'm not falling down. I'm not falling down today. Not today! Alright, then down here, the door needs a key. Yeah, I imagine it's the headmaster key or something. Glass shards, and can we unlock the door down here? Is it already, un is it already unlocked or something? Where am I? I didn't, ent I didn't enter here. I have no idea where I'm going. Uh, welcome, Julia! I don't know if I should take something here. I actually don't even remember. I don't even remember this place, to be honest. Potentially... Oh, wait, I'm on the other side. Ah, okay, now I know where I am. In there, there is another bookshelf, though. I may need it. So, I should juke this guy. Come on. Come on. Okay. She's gonna block me from behind once I go back down there. But still, I need this bookshelf, I think. Can I loot it? Oh, from the other side, I guess. Okay. Come here. Good enough. Good enough. Maybe I'm able to even... Comp can I access the bookshelf, actually? Yeah. No? It's useless? Bro! Um... Well, we're gonna wait. Uh... <laughs> It works like 10% of the time. Ah! What do you mean I was on the right side for looting it? Uh, no, it's not Jover. I can still farm regardless, but I don't want to. Is it really? There is there really no other way to escape from this? Uh, okay, if I do this, maybe he will stop seeing me. Yeah, see it? I'm so good at the game. <laughs> I'm so good at the game. Uh, you know what? Oh, can I, I can walk diagonally. That's very good for uh, juking them, I guess. All right. And just like that. Okay, you guys said I was on the correct side. I. It doesn't seem so. I can. I cannot take it. Whatever. We don't care about that. Let's continue. We have to reach Father Hugo. Welcome, Mako Bell. Welcome to stream, my friend. Come on. Thanks, Pinecom Pig. <laughs> All right. Never forget that Apollo is the god of dodge. <laughs> and there is another ghost. Can I get a golden chanterelle? Uh, no. How many shillings do I have? 24. No, there is no way I'm farming for another 99 shillings. Uh, no, 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 no. 
I mean, I could, but it will require a lot of time, and if I fail, it's gonna be so jover for my uh, for my self-esteem or something. Welcome, Christex. Welcome to stream, my friend. I think uh, the best plan is just to go for Father Hugo and just roll with it in case I'm able to do it. Uh, but still, let's try to get Alchemilia Volume 3 at least. That's what I'm gonna do now. No, it's Jover is definitely not. Yeah, I have a lot of a lot of things that I can do in this moment. The problem is uh, I don't know if they will be enough. Nothing. Nothing. Lucky coin, useless uh, as hell. Listening to the stream more than I actually watch it as I'm currently playing Terminal myself. Uh, nice. Uh, where are you playing? Yes, Julia. Okay. Here there should be more lockers. That, me that means more shieldings, uh, potentially. Nah. Whatever. Also... Uh, no, no! Oh, I remember! I got blocked here previous time, but I guess I should be fine. I just have to use the beds correctly. And uh, I think there should be a bookshelf. No, there are more lockers. Whatever, they cannot block me from two sides in this exact moment. There are more lockers. Okay, there is only one cherub following me, so I guess I can... Ah! Glass shards, that's not bad. Uh, not, not good, but not bad. Now, if only I could get at least the Alchemilia. I need uh, some way to heal myself against Father Hugo. Otherwise, we will have to farm a little bit, just a little bit, to get, like, a, I don't know... Uh... This is problematic. How do I do this? Uh, this is very problematic. Okay, now I can do it. Uh, they help me, unintentionally or not. Getting bullied by toddlers. Yeah, but now we're fine, now we're fine, because uh, one of them was stupid enough to stop following me in the correct way to block him. Uh, uh, to block me? Uh, <laughs> no, you're not stupid, I'm joking, I'm joking, you're fantastic, my friend. You're rocking it, you're rocking it. Here there should be a bookshelf that I can actually loot. Can I loot this one? No. Ah! Hmm? Uh oh, the other one is coming. Am I gonna get blocked? Okay, no! No! I'm not gonna get blocked! <laughs> Goodbye, you morons! No! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> this is so bad. Okay, I know where I am. Here there should be some bookshelves. You skipped my answer to your question, it seems. So, oh wait, let me see. Uh, sorry, I was <laughs> I was busy. Playing as Dan and going for the B ending. Oh, interesting. Day 3 night to, to practice for Mazo. Okay, interesting. If you want to... Uh, I suggest to pra pra in order to practice for Mazo, to use Olivia Wheelchairless. I think that helps you a lot. I'm not gonna stop insulting the Sherubs. And I get many in Dreams Fly. Ah, Horrible. I could get Alchemilia or freaking Book of Enlightenment and I get the stupid uh, Man in Dreams flyer. Here though, there should be another bookshelf. Uh, no. Okay, no bookshelf for me. And there is a, the, the, the ghost kid. And I get a small key, not bad. Not bad, but it's not what I need now. You know what? Let's just rush for uh, Father Hugo and that's it. Wait, uh, there's a bookshelf there. I think I didn't loot it. Uh, will you keep the grading poor Rag too? Uh, I mean, uh, the um, <laughs> Rag is already degrading himself by doing uh, literally nothing, so I guess uh, I cannot add much to it. Overconfidence is a slow and insidious skill. I know, but I think if I try and die more times, maybe I'm gonna do it at one point. And if uh, I get the correct RNG, I'm able to kill it without problems, uh, and then... Uh, I can get uh, Branch Toss. Also, wait, uh, I forgot to go and uh, use the Sigil of Grow Growth to get Necromancy. Ha I'm not even gonna be able to defeat Sergal at this point. Mm. No, I think... Uh, okay, I have an idea. I have an idea, no worries. I have an idea. Rag Slender. As I said, the Rag uh, is already <laughs> the most bad character everywhere. So there is really nothing that I can add to the mix. Rag did more by doing nothing that Kahara managed to do while doing something. Shut up, Gecko! Don't even try to say that in my presence. No, 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 no. 
You cannot freaking say that, that Ragnavaldor did more stuff than Kahara. Shut up. And then nothing! Why am I getting nothing? I've just completed Olivia B ending before, uh, uh, so won't try again. I need to do B endings of Dan, Karin, Osa, Levi, and Abella. Abella would be Maso. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I think I should farm in this moment. I think this is the moment in which I should farm. I have... Uh, how many shillings? 36. Yeah, you know what, guys? Maybe this may be the moment in which I start farming. Potentially, that's gonna be it. Hmm. For probably up his streak by insulting Raggy Daddy. You know... No, I have another plan. I... Actually, guys... Uh, what do I need to kill Hugo for? Let me explain, let me explain, okay? Hugo is needed for... Access to the Axon. And that's it. Like, uh, Father Hugo only allows me to have more possibilities. So... It's better to kill Hugo before farm... Yeah, absolutely. No, bloody gems, I mean... If I get the hardened heart, I can guaranteedly kill him. But yeah, I understand your point. But still, the point that I want to make is... Uh, if I'm able to kill Father Hugo... I get the Axen. But... If I'm able to get the effigies... And now I can get the effigies because I... Uh, I can actually escape from the battles. And also... I... I reach Sergal and I beat Sergal. That's it. Father Hugo is need isn't needed anymore. I just need a way to beat Sergal. Mmm... That's maybe the only problem. <laughs> a way to beat Sergal may be the only problem. Mm. You know what? Yeah, you're the, you're right, Commissar. Better prepared than luck. Yeah. Let's continue with the plan of defeating Father Hugo. We are not uh, we are not that it's not that difficult regardless. No, no, no. We're going to do Hugo Karas. At least I'm going to make an attempt on him. If I die, I may reconsider it. Also, nothing. Alright, if I'm if I'm good at the game, I will be able to juke all of them. And I am good I'm not good at the game, I'm stupid. Or maybe not. Or maybe not. Or maybe not. Okay! We are so fine. Perfect. <laughs> if you skip Hugo, you won't have to worry about gold bros anymore. I mean they're not a problem because I I just can escape from them for shielding, sir. So good. Lucky da come on Jacko, that wasn't luck. Come on. Alright, we have four forty shieldings actually. Maybe I don't even need to farm. They can block you, yeah, but uh, they don't stun lock me two times in a row. I don't know to, I don't know how to explain it. Oh, I can make another one, okay. No, we should be fine with the healings actually. We should be so fine. Do we have some dark blue root or something? Uh, it's in healing. Yeah, we do. Can't you just kill Levi in the school and he won't uh, team up in the Moon Realm blocking the effigies? Uh, destruction, the problem is not Levi. Levi is uh, the last, the, the, the least of our problems, uh, literally. So, how do we approach the fight? First of all, let me put on uh, the sturdy overalls to reduce fire damage. After that, I could use the arm guards because... Uh, no, but the, the protection for, for, from the arm guards is useless against fire. I don't really need anything for the other one. I, I could put the one-winged necklace to be sure I don't die. The plan is just uh, first turn... Uh, yeah, first turn... Uh, murky Vial. And that's it. Alright. Here goes nothing, guys. Uh, yeah, let's use this one. This gives me regen. I want to start the fight with regen. I know he it heals 50. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. Soul Devour Necklace, but also hurting for his limbs. He doesn't use hurting. What do you mean? I don't have pep pills. I don't have pep pills. I have zero pep pills. Completely without pep pills. Oh, wait. Uh, Purifying Talisman. I could use this. Wait, how do I access the... No, wait. Uh... Does he drop... No, he doesn't drop a Purifying Talisman. Is there a guaranteed Purifying Talisman? Because, uh... Mm. Oh, it doesn't work. Yeah, yeah. I, I remember now. <laughs> For a second, I for gore. Alright, I guess that's it. Let's just enter with the region. 
also that will help you for our re recipe. I don't have our recipe. I, I don't have the recipe, Re Rebel Wolf. Okay. I didn't check if irritation works on Hugo Arms. That's because we are gonna murder him like this. Boom. Miss! That's the RNG I'm aiming for. That's the R. <laughs> Good start. Good start. Now. I guess now we just use a blue vial. Or we use nothing. And the reason I say nothing is because uh, the first one is gonna deal me some damage. The second one is gonna reduce the damage because I have the necklace equipped. So I should be fine. Yeah. Uh, guard, once again. Paramancy trick. 14. 16. And I heal 5. I, I censored the PP? Yeah, 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 I did. Now. I use a freaking mixed herbs. And I'm better. Let's just guard and let's hope, please. Combustion. Eh? 29, combustion. Missed. Okay. I'm gonna use the blue vial in this turn. I think, uh, yeah. I think that's the best idea to, to do. Guard. Paramancy trick. Uh, combustion, we are fine. How much life does he have? I need to use the last mixed herbs that I have. Please, please, permanent trick, 50 damage. I didn't deal enough damage. Let's try. Bro, can you freaking die? How much life do you have? Oh well, I guess uh, it's Jover. Ah! <laughs> I could destroy the penis, but uh, I guess. Yeah, he isn't dying. Let's try to use the glass shards. Maybe he has like one of one or two health. No. Goodbye. Mm. No, guys, you know what do we have to do? We have to farm for the hardened heart. In that way, we get both healing items and we get the literal best accessory in the game, potentially. No, Jack, there is no need to use the gasoline canister, it's literally the same. Okay, I'm not gonna open any chest in this moment because uh, I have 99 shillings. Yeah, it's gonna be a sort of farming, I have an idea. I'm gonna open everything that I can, all the barrels, etc, because... Uh, that way we're gonna get more shillings. After that, the other plan is getting the Ardent Heart, but... You know what? I may do something. In the process... Mm, I wanted to go down to the moldy apartments to see if I'm able to come back from there. But I guess I should... No, wait, I don't even need to enter here. I'm gonna go back here later. Because there are 10 shillings inside of there. I cannot take them. It's not farming time in this exact moment, Pumpkin Fights... Uh, it's gonna be a kind of... Uh, a type of farming. So... We are gonna go to the moldy apartments to get some loot. Okay? Second round of Smasher Pass, maybe. <laughs> Smasher Pass. Olivia. Also, off-stream Dark Raccoon told me... Uh, moldy apartments is like one of the most dangerous areas. Especially in this type of run, because there are the bell lands. But I guess it's easy. I think it's easy. Like, I don't think it's that difficult to deal with the balance. But we will see. Like, uh, maybe Dark Raccoon knows what he's saying, but I, I want to see it myself. Pass, she can't talk. Olivia? Olivia can talk, what do you mean? With or without the wheelchair? With the wheelchair, Reddit girlfriend, of course with the wheelchair. If you want Olivia, you take the whole Olivia, you don't take half of an Olivia. If you could eat any food from Fionnager 1 or 2, what food and why? That's a very bizarre question. I think I would eat uh, turnip, because it's the food that the pinecone pig brings the most, so maybe it's the mo it's the best one, in his opinion. 
I really want to see Pinecone Pigs taste this. Y you know? <laughs> That's a weird reason. Also, let me turn uh, on my light. Jesus, I wasn't seeing anything. Four shillings! Uh, we have it! We have it! We have two small things I'm let. Now, now we just need 99 uh, shillings for the hardened heart. Dirt sounds good. Okay. Ah, uh, now we have a, a chance of surviving, guys. We should have pulse for this measure pass. The problem is the sweet I cannot make a pulse for each one of them because uh, I need to play the game. I can otherwise I need to stop the stream. But at the, at the moment, uh, if I, if I do that, uh, it isn't anymore as measure pass. While we do the challenge, it's gonna be a, a smasher pass, and that's it. And I don't think that's particularly interesting. Imagine a, imagine a stream only based on doing a smasher pass. <laughs> imagine a stream only based on doing a smasher pass, literally. From start to, to finish, hey guys, so today we're gonna do some smasher pass. Are you ready? Like, a, nah, I don't, I don't think that's interesting. Give me more shillings. Lucky coin, matches. And here we get something good. We get something crazy. We get... Uh, Ballistic shield. Uh, I mean, fire eighty percent. I mean, fire eighty percent. That means uh, if we take fifty damage uh, from from uh, pyromancy trick, uh, well, we have this the um, the suite of Abella. With that one, we're gonna take twenty percent less, uh, and the twenty percent is we're gonna take forty damage uh, overall. Team Smasher Pass stream when? <laughs> I wanted to make another collab with some other people on Fear and Hunger 1 to do something similar uh, to the thing that I made in Fear and Hunger 2 for the skills. Like a uh, uh, Fear and Hunger 1 skill tier list, but there is an impostor. But I still uh, have no idea about who to choose for that one. I have some ideas in my mind, but I want to be extra sure before I do it. It's gonna be a content for the future regardless. It's gonna be... In, uh, in one or two weeks, uh, not immediately. But I really want to do it. I, I love doing this Amogus uh, stuff, you know. I don't know why, it, it's pretty easy, it's pretty interesting. Uh, and the other problem is uh, Ragnavalder skills. Everyone knows that I hate... Uh, that I... F I mean... Uh, no, I'm not gonna say anything, you know. I'm not gonna say anything. Uh, that way you, not, you won't know for when we go to the skill tier list. I'm not gonna say anything, guys. You're not gonna be able to get information from me. Amogus. Yeah, I want to do a Fear and Hunger 1 skill tier list, such as the one that I did for Termina. Let's get the sewer winch. It's time to go for the moldy apartments. And I guess I could also take the, the FEG. Hmm. Nah. Let's explore the whole orphanage to get some useful books and stuff. Then we go back. Or we immediately go to the moldy apartments to see if you are if you are able to do that, and then we focus on the rest. That's potentially an idea. Okay, here we are. Are we fine? Yeah, we're fine. Hello, also part of the stream. You wanna go to the moldy apartments? Yeah, Lolozo. Because uh, if I'm able to open the path to Sergal, then potentially I don't even need to deal with uh, Father Hugo at all. There are some shillings inside of Father Hugo's home, but they are not that useful, honestly. The only two problems with the Moldy Apartments are... Uh, Dark Raccoon told me about uh, two balance present there. And the other problem is a freaking uh, mob. If we get the mob, that may be a, a game over. Four shillings! That's good, that's good. There is a chest up there. I was scared because of the time and of getting blocked by the umbrellas. So for now, the chest is gonna stay there and closed. You people are sick for Sickle Villager, you must all be purged. So, um, yeah, Sickle Villagers, measure pass. Welcome, Gabriel Pez Rocha. Welcome, my friend. Let me drink a little bit. I didn't prepare the water today. I only have half of a bottle. Uh, for the eating quest uh, question, personally, my first game I would eat the Crow Molar, as I did in my Ragnavaldar's ending. The second game, as I would say, I did Abella's. Ah, uh, redacted! <laughs> I mean, I think I would do that too, you know? Like, uh, Abella 
I think when uh, Miro designed Abella, designed her in order for her to be like the most uh, sexy possible. I may be wrong, but like, uh, look at her. Like, it's not a secret that she's potentially the cutest one of the of the contestants. Uh, uh, she and Marina are my favorite ones, uh, aesthetically talking. Like, aesthetically speaking, uh, she and Marina are my favorite ones. Genuine sadness from Frap when he didn't prep his water. <laughs> and, oh! Dank boy, thank you so much for the two dollars, my friend! Hydrate, yeah, yeah, yeah. If I, if I finish the water, I'm gonna stop for a second this year and I'm gonna take it off, off stream. But for now, I'm good. Thank you so much, Dank Boy. Uh oh, no. Are we gonna trigger the bell end? No, the bell end wasn't triggered, indeed. Good. Now, no, I will not uh, hydrate the calculator this time. I will not. If uh, if you guys are wondering, uh, previous stream, uh, I was drinking and I almost make and I almost spoiled water on the calculator that was near my <laughs> my my PC, my laptop. Sorry. Okay. I guess it's time. Moldy Apartments it is. Thank you so much, Dank Boy. Moldy Apartments, let's go! If we trigger the mob, I'm gonna be not angry. Because, uh, after all... Wait, actually, I have to hurry up. We already know what happens here. There's gonna be this one. And I got a golden chanterelle! That's crazy. Then... Can I enter the sewers very fast? Please? Please? Goodbye, idiot! Okay, I know where I am. I just need this to reset the timer regardless. And here there is the, the hound. How do I deal with the hound? If you had to turn a fungi enemy into a Black Souls girl, who would it be? That's an interesting question. Wait, I have to reset the timer. Uh, that that's gonna be a problem. A fungi enemy into a Black Souls girl, I think I would make pocket. <laughs> pocket cat. What a silly billy query. Okay, he's not gonna move from there. We have to juke that guy if we want to go to the moldy apartments. What a silly billy question. It was obvious I was gonna answer Pocket Cat. Sometimes I think you don't know me, Zionis. You give me this impression you don't know me. What a silly question. Who am I gonna transform into a, into a girl? No. 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 And I hear needles too. Hmm? Oh, it's just a normal a normal villager? What is a normal villager doing here? Bro! How many people? Um uh, Am I blocked? Okay. I think I have a space down. Bro. Can I enter in the apartment? <laughs> okay, I entered the... <laughs> Owned it! Thank you so much for the follow, uh, Gatzalas K. How are you... are we gonna... are we gonna... <laughs> escape from the apartment? <laughs> There's like 20 people out there! <laughs> <laughs> they closed the door, probably. They are the responsible for closing the door. Can you show your build, please? Sure, Ivan. This is my build. Black steel. I mean, uh, the, 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 the weapon doesn't really matter. Oh, wait, I have to keep this. Two small things I'm to always escape. Pine con pig. That's my build. It's not the best build, but it's a build. Now... How do we do? You could use golden gates to flee through rare dimension. Yeah, you're right, Scorf. The problem is I don't have uh, I don't have golden gate because I would need affinity. And to get affinity, I would need to defeat Father Hugo. And to defeat freaking Father Hugo, I would need to go with the normal strategy. At which point, I don't even need to go down here. By the way, uh, Dark Raccoon told me it's a one, thir one in three chance. The, the, um, the, the mob from spawning. So we got unlucky, technically, in this moment. But still... Oh, and there are also the balance. I still don't have no idea about how I'm gonna live. Probably it's gonna be a reset, but I want to see how difficult it is to reach the effigy. Uh, two... 
6, 11, and 13. Thank you so much for the follow. The, re the ride never ends. 1, 2, 3. Thank you so much, my friend. So, uh, uh, 11, 13, 6, 2. No, uh, I don't remember. Uh, how was it? Uh, was it 2, 11, 13, 6? Uh, Raccoon, can you help me? I don't remember. I don't remember the, the password. Uh, with the golden gates, you still need to ca to have keys or lock picking to open the ca the gates. I mean, that's not a problem, Julia. But uh, hmm. look up my video. Ah, come on, tell me, Dark Raccoon. Uh, th these are the numbers six nine. Oh nine. Okay, I'm gonna open Dark Raccoon video real quick. Wait a. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a second, because the stupid moron is not gonna tell me. Nine thirteen six eleven. If you are just uh, throwing random numbers, nine thirteen uh, six eleven. No. The order is randomized, but there is a set amount of combinations that can happen. Okay, let's look the video. Fear and hunger. 2, 13, 11, 6. So it's 2 the number. Wait. Wait. It's. Two. Whatever. I'm gonna open the. I'm gonna. I'm gonna open the video. No worries. Uh, fear and hunger termina. Uh, how is it called? Uh, moldy apartments, I guess. Moldy apartments. Because the stupid moron of Dark Raccoon cannot just say the the, the codes. Uh, he wants me to go and check them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't have to watch the I don't have to watch the TV, Jack. That's not true. There is a set amount of uh, combinations possible. I cannot even find your video. Ah, oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Stop talking, you moron. Okay. Okay, fortunately you made a, a time skip just to the code. Okay. Thir 13, 2, 6, 11. Okay. Let let's try. 13, 2, 6, 11. No. It's not cheating, uh, Gecko. I already know the combination, just don't remember. 2, 11, 13, 6. I think I already made this one, but whatever. 2, 11, 13, 6. No. And 9, 13, 11, 6. 9, 13, 11. Thank you so much for the follow. Oh, there it is. Thank you. Thank you so much, Joy Price. Thank you so much, my friend. All right. And thank you so much to Brandon Bronte also. Thank you so much, my friend. All right. It's time to enter. I still have no idea about how to live. But for now, let's continue. Okay. Time for the best soundtrack of the game. Here we are. Bing, 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 bing. Can't you just dodge? The problem is, if there is more than one enemy, I cannot dodge. And also, they blocked me in one angle. So unless the the AI is really dumb... Can I put a hand inside of this? Oh, small key, okay. Interesting. Yeah, it's not cheating. Like, there is a set amount of combinations. I already knew them. I just didn't remember those. Come on, it's not cheating. Exactly, it's not cheating. Is Marco da... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> now we know where is Marco. Now we freaking know where is Marco. Is it safe to put your hand in there? I think one time it is, Zeris. I don't know if more times is a problem, but one time it for, for sure is, is safe. Okay, there is a neighbor. Wait. Uh, I heard a gate opening. Is Marco free? Ah! The music! I love this. It scares me even now that uh, a lot of time has passed. Wait, uh, that, that sound is Marco! Um, uh, am I blocked? I don't think I'm blocked. Uh, hmm. I don't know if it's a positive that I'm blocking uh, all the stupid morons. Uh, they just turned into an iron door. <laughs> Where is the door in which I can actually enter? Uh, Marco! Marco! Hmm. Uh, okay. No! 
I'm blocked with the, <laughs> the neighbor and the Marco. Um, this is a reset, I guess. No, it is not a reset. It's not a reset. It is a reset. <laughs> ah! Shillings! I guess we are gonna have to farm if we want to escape. And now there is Mark. No, it's another neighbor. And now there is another neighbor. And now there is another neighbor. I have seen this doujin. <laughs> okay, we're gonna try to kill one, okay? We are blocked regardless, so I guess we can as, as well just try to kill one with the murky vial. Destroy the head! Okay. We can go to the right. Just kill Marco, easy. Hello Marco, goodbye Marco, see ya. So, is this Marco? No, this is another neighbor. I mean, technically it is a neighbor. It's very similar to a neighbor, okay. Now, I think I have to go up. Is Marco gonna follow me even up here? I love this music. I freaking love it. The question is, can I open this door? No. Do I have to open the doors in the normal apartment in order to open them here or something? Because I remember I was able to open some of these doors. Maybe I'm remembering incorrectly, but still. Hmm. Can I open this one? No, I cannot open anything. Bro. Why can't I open... Oh, the master key! I forgot the master key. That's the problem. <laughs> I forgot the master key. That's the... Pro oh, this uh, this staircase is blocked, right? Uh, yeah, this staircase is blocked. I forgot the master key, guys. That's, that is the problem. That is indeed a problem. <laughs> you know, guys, I, I guess it's better if we, if we just reset. There is no way in which we are going to be able to DL uh, with the, the enemies outside in this ex in this current state. Uh, no. No. Let's... The, 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 the streaming starts now, okay? The stream starts now. So, welcome, guys. Welcome to my gameplay of Fear and Hunger Termina. So. What we're going to do is today we're going to complete Olivia uh, Masomod Wilcherless. I'm going insane trying to find a Bible of Hunger. I can imagine that. Rare! Good rare! Good. Okay. Hmm. Fading fast in a... It's a boomerang body. Okay, so. I have a plan. It's gonna require a lot of stuff, but I do have a great plan. We are gonna farm once again 99 shillings for the hardened heart, but this time I know of the guaranteed shillings inside of the orphanage, and... Uh, I also want to go back, once I have 100% uh, escape possibility, in order to get the sigil of Grogroth from the church. Today we are gonna defeat at least Father Hugo and potentially the mob. Okay guys, today we are gonna defeat at least Father Hugo and the mob. I don't need to loot inside of here because... Uh, will you kill Hugo? I will, Gecko. I will because I need necromancy. There is no way I'm gonna be able to beat mob and balance back to back without other stuff, because uh, my knowledge of Belland and Mob is not that vast for now. I have a safe, uh, somewhat safe plan to kill the Mob having a Branch Toss and Necromancy. Just grind for 3 hours. Yeah, I, I don't want this stream to become boring at one point, because I like talking with you guys, but I guess that's not... I, I can imagine that's not the same for everyone, and thank you so much for the follow, uh, Sense Dot. Thank you so much, my friend. How was your day for Apollo? Um, my day was pretty good this week. I was in university for some time, and uh, I was able to um, to study a lot. I'm happy about that. The problem is, uh, I'm a little bit sad because uh, I tried to contact the one that is supposed to make me the new PC, and he wasn't answering the phone. Literally. He wasn't freaking answering the phone. That's the only thing that I just didn't like for today. But the rest was pretty nice. How was your day, guys? Do you have money for Wild Dug? Uh, it paralyzes... Uh, like the branch toss does. Yeah, but it's temporarily. Like, I'm not gonna spend 25 shillings for one single wild dagger. Imagine if I want to farm, I don't know, 99 wild dagger. It's gonna require ages. Ages. I could get those with undergrowth awareness. 
But I don't... Uh, nah, I don't. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna... Sh five shillings, good. Now, we're gonna enter the orphanage, take all the guaranteed shillings from the lockers, then we leave, and we go make the sigil of Grogroth, farm for the remaining shillings, sold our necklace, that's not bad, and more shilling, farm for the remaining shillings, as I said, and after that, bro, did I get the soul stone or no? Did I... Why didn't I get the soul stone? Uh... Huh? Why didn't he give me the, the soul stone? You picked the wrong option. So... So I don't have a soul stone anymore? Bro! Reset. Uh... Potentially... Wait, if I go back... If I freaking go back... You got it, maybe... And skip no I didn't. I tried Ah Um Oh oh no 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 I didn't censor this <laughs> I didn't censor this <laughs> I didn't censor the, the death animation I don't know uh, how is it because I don't remember but I didn't censor it I'm sure I didn't censor it so no Come on we just have to hope New points of love and torment also can I loot something from here Oh yeah, the rifle and the ammos. Whatever, guys, we're fine, we're fine. We made one mistake, that's what happens. I think something like that might have happened once to me, but I didn't pay attention to it, sadly. Oh, okay. But fist in time. But fi- oh, oh! That's what happens when you, when you lose the coin flip or something. You can get a trench gun in the corner too, I think. Yeah, the problem is... Uh, it's not useful, Mako Bell. Like, uh, I didn't want to get the rifle. I just wanted to see what was inside of there. I cannot use uh, uh, ranged weapons uh, while I'm wheelchairless, uh, unfortunately. Yeah, guns are useless for you, exactly. But, uh, if we get the Ardent Heart, uh, there is a possibility of defeating Sergal. Ardent Heart and the pipe and the branch toss. Uh. And if we, th if we throw Necromancy into the mix, it's guaranteed, potentially. Potentially guaranteed. But I need more s I need more heads. Is there a safe way to kill enemies, guys? I feel like I need some more heads to get more soul stones from the new god's altar. I really think that. First death today. Technically the second, the sweet. I died after farming for two hours at the start. Jesus, I will never forget that moment. I was so stupid, Jesus, uh, Guns are a safe way, I cannot use them, Shmo, I cannot use them. Oh, so wait, uh, I, have to, I, have to, I have to spend the shillings, actually. Uh, sorry, yeah, yeah, sorry, Dr. Kef, I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything, I was just stealing your stuff. Alright. Now, give me some, uh, some shillings, just far enough to murky them. The problem, Commissar, is uh, oil, which is necessary in order to create murky vials, uh, is not guaranteed. From Pinko Pig you only get Golden Chanterelle. You don't get oil. So, I only have... Frap is a boy. Yeah, I am a boy. What do you mean? Like, uh, I only have a limited amount of Murky Vials for, uh, until I get a new type of attack from the Hexen. Is oil just a random drop? It is a random drop. I don't know if there is a place in which you can guaranteedly get him. I think it's just a random drop. And the Kaiser Rise to Power. Ah... Uh, what do you mean unconfirmed? I'm a boy, yeah, I'm a ragazzo, exactly. <laughs> ragazzo is boy in Italian. And here we get- wait, why didn't I use- uh, oh, whatever, booby trap. Not useful anymore, but uh, that's fine. I am a boy, why, why are you asking me if I'm a boy, guys? Is it uh, difficult to understand for my voice? Do you think my voice is not boyish enough? Can you turn into a girl or into a fanboy? Maybe, who knows, maybe my moon, my moon scorch form is a, is a girl. Who knows? Maybe. Frapol is using voice changer. No! <laughs> we ask just in case. Sure, sure. Okay, we already have 15 shillings. That's not bad at all. 15 shillings means we have uh, one sixth of a hardened heart. Come on. We can do this very quickly. I just have to focus. We could farm in the sewers. 
But before farming, uh, we're gonna go to the orphanage for more stuff, okay? Thank you so much for the follow, I cannot read your name! Also, I, I heard the seagulls, thank you so much for the follow, for uh, whoever you were, I'm sorry. I'm gonna read it afterwards. Uh, ornament lantern, six shillings, guys! Six shillings! I'm the, <laughs> the most excitement for six shillings from a barrel! <laughs> I swear, that was the most exciting moment, in my opinion. Ta-da, ta-da! Alright, who was that? Thank you so much for the follow! Silent Echo! 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 Echo or Echo? One of the two. Thank you so much, my friend. Alright. Yeah, guys, if you... <laughs> make a... Make a fan art of me moon scorched as a fanboy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, give me Book of Enlightenment. Mahabra. He did the needle sing. Yeah. Ta -da, ta -da. Ta -da, ta -da. Small key, lavender. Are you sure this is uh, s this is static? The drops seem different this time. I'm not getting anything from this. Uh, I don't think it's static. Are you sure, Dark Raccoon? You said uh, it's static, but uh, hmm, I don't know. For piece of boy, I thought he was Italian. Yeah, uh, uh, you can be boy and Italian. <gasps> there is a there is a nice uh, song. I don't know if you know it, guys. Uh, uh, it's uh, I think it's called uh, Gay or European. It's a so it's a very nice song in my opinion. <laughs> Basically, it's a song about uh, um, people questioning if a person they see is gay or European, and it's pretty interesting. And it's pretty funny as a as a song. I know it because uh, in uh, Persona Five, there is actually a character that may be misunderstood for being uh, like that for being gay, and so they made a, a version of this song with uh, Alchemilia. Good. They made a version of this song with him as the one that is questioned if he's gay or European. And so, I, I enjoyed this song a lot. And uh, I am European, but not gay. I'm sorry guys, I'm not gay. Alright. I finished the water! Mm. After this, I have to go and get it. Yusuke is gay? No! Yusuke is not gay. It's not confirmed at least. I think. Yeah, Yusuke is the character of Persona 5 that is supposed to be gay. Pocket Cat Pocket Cat says otherwise. <laughs> Whatever. We don't listen to Pocket Cat. Let's fall down, I don't really think it's a problem. Maybe there's gonna be the priest. But I guess uh, here I can get something useful. There is a bone saw or something and maybe even a chest. So I don't really care about the priest itself. Oh, good morning! Oh no, wait, I know where I am, I can exit from up here and there is no problem. There's just that one uh, cherub, but it's not a problem and we get some ammos. That's fine, that's fine! Frap is only gay for Pocket Cat. I mean, Pocket Cat is technically is not a boy. Pocket Cat is a, is a magical being. I don't think he has, a, he has a gender. Let's make this talk, guys. Do you think Pocket Cat has a gender? Like, a, he's supposed to be a, a, a mystical being. I think mystical beings uh, don't... Uh, don't, uh, aren't uh, neither uh, boys or girls, uh, I think. I may be wrong with this. Non-binary point. <laughs> I yeah, technical. like... Uh, can you really give a gender to mystical beings? Uh, like, uh... Let's talk about Sylvian, okay, guys? Let's talk about Sylvian for a second. All of you think uh, probably that Sylvian uh, is considerable a woman, okay? But is her a woman? Like, uh, she's a mystical being, she's a, a, a old god. I don't think she has uh, a gender. Like, uh, let's try to think about it uh, conceptually for some time. I think it makes sense. Not Sergal, Sylvian, Sylvian, <laughs> not Sergal. Sergal, uh, Sergal is supposed to be a woman, if I remember correctly. Uh, Kone is translated into uh, wife. Mataneko Kone Magnificat. So, uh, Sergal should potentially be a woman, from what I understand. Sylvian isn't a woman, but she's a, a girl boss. Yeah, technically. She's, re she's referred to as a she. Yeah, but, uh, I mean... How would you refer to a mystical being? Like, you, you try to give a gender to what you can't describe. Like, uh, people have always tried to do that. Uh, try to give a sense... Uh, to things you can't comprehend, such as old gods. People always try to do that, not only with old gods, even in uh, in uh, in real life. 
We came from the... Uh, ah! Or from a womb. <laughs> uh, that's a good question, Conductor. I, but, but I think... I sh like, we didn't... Uh-oh. Uh Am I gonna fail once again? No, okay. Does, it, does this mean I'm, I'm an old god? No! What do you... Uh, no, sorry, Afri. Uh, let, me, let me rephrase that. I don't mean in that sense. I mean... Uh, Maybe people uh, are giving are giving Sylvian the um, the prefix she because they want to give her a prefix, not specifically because uh, uh, Sylvian is a she. Like, uh, barely we even know what is the greater scheme of things and the type of stuff. How do we know Sylvian is a she? Like, uh, who is the guy that woke up and told? Uh, all right, guys, you know, there is this old god called Sylvian, and uh, she is a she, so that's it. Uh, deal with it. GG. So, uh, so like, uh, it's very strange in my opinion. I'm so confused. <laughs> I'm confused as well in trying to explain it. Uh, she is a pronoun, not a prefix. Yeah, sorry, pronoun. I, 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 I used the incorrect word. But still, the, the point is the same. Like, uh, I think... Like, who is the guy that stood up and said, Guys, I know about this old god. It's called Sylvian, and it's a she. <laughs> her pronouns are she, her. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Imagine in the ancient city of Mahabra someone saying, Do you know Sylvian? Her pronouns is she and her. <laughs> Like, uh, when they talk about the information of the god, uh, like, uh, did she create us or something like that? Uh, and then they just change the topic and, uh, what, are, what, are the, what are her pronouns? Ah, uh, it's uh, she, her. That's, uh, that, <laughs> that makes me laugh a little bit, I don't know why. We do the same with our god's uh, IRL. Yeah, exactly, Pistachios. Even, uh, uh, like, uh, Christian church, like, uh, uh, worships Jesus. Jesus is always represented as a boy, never as a girl. Literally, and uh, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna soft lock myself if I don't pay attention. Okay, we're fine. Sylvian's pronouns are marriage. <laughs> Lucky gave birth, but he's a no. But he's uh, ah no. Sorry, I wasn't looking. Okay, okay. That is to some top tier level <laughs> juke. Ah. Then how Vinushka came into existence. Then, again, they are gods. I don't think the way in which we make children is the same is the same way in which gods make children. Like, I don't think we can uh, associate our ways to do stuff to their ways of doing stuff. I think those are two completely different speed, uh, two completely different things. Uh, want cancelled speedrun. What do you mean cancelled? There is no problem in talking about, uh, in talking about these arguments. Uh, Vinushka is not some creation. Yeah, but what what tells you that uh, uh, th there needs to be so so wait, uh, so you're telling me, th uh, so you're telling me Sylvian is the only female old god known, and so potentially is the only female old god existent. And then I ask you a question: What created Sylvian? Why can't uh, what created Sylvian create other old gods? Uh? Like, uh, I don't think the way in which new, in which new old gods are created, uh, then uh, it's the same one for us. Like, uh, it's pretty complex as a, as, a, as a discussion, I know, but try to stick with me. Like, uh, I don't think an old god borns, uh, is born in the same way as a human. Vitruvia, Vitruvia is not an old god, technically. There is no knowledge about Vitruvia being an old god, it's not confirmed. While it is confirmed for uh, Sylvian to be um, an old god, Vitruvia could also just be a new god or something that got powers from Sylvian. Can't you girls become a marriage? I mean, Zionis, uh, in the first game, Darcy can. You cannot do that with another girl, in the first game at least. And in the second game, as you can see, there is no way you're becoming a marriage. So we will never know for now. I think it's not out of the of the possibilities, uh, considering like uh, there is the skill Demon Seed, which can be used by Darcy, even though um, <clears throat> you you know, you know. Yeah, like uh, old gods are concepts. Uh, like I don't think uh, a concept uh, is created with a physical act between Grogroth and Sylvian to create Venushka. I think Venushka. It's more like uh, the concept needed to be born. And Sylvian and Grogroth took responsibilities of creating it. 
but not like in a physical act or something. They literally plasmed it or something. I don't know, I don't know if plasmation is a word in English. But I think it's something like that, like... Uh, I think. I may be completely wrong on this. But uh, uh, even if love isn't actually a feminine thing... Yeah, exactly. Like, uh, the real point of the discussion is, uh, do we think uh, old gods, uh, like, uh, if, you, if you think a physical act is needed, you're completely wrong, uh, and let me explain why. Old gods uh, start uh, with the premise of, of being concepts, uh, not physical beings. Uh, they have physical bodies, uh, the traces, uh, but those are just a, a manifestation of the old gods. It's not the actual old god. So the problem is... Uh-oh, uh uh-oh, bro! Okay. The problem is, uh, if they really needed a physical act in order to create uh, a new old god, then they wouldn't be much of a concept anymore. Do you understand what I, may, what I mean? Like, uh, what is the purpose of being a concept if you need a physical body in order to create a son? That's why I think, uh, uh, lore speaking, uh, Sylvan and Grogroth uh, didn't give birth to uh, Dinushka in the same way in which we are born or something. But, uh, but um, it's more like a concept thing. Why did we start... Wait, guys, uh, I forgot. Why did we, start, we, did we start talking about all of this? <laughs> I genuinely forgot. I, I kind of wish for Polo managed to read my comment about my pronouns, though. Uh, oh, wait, tell me, Afri, tell me. Tell me, uh, uh, I can't escape pronouns debates, uh, da, 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 da. uh write me once again your pronouns, Afri, sorry. Did I mispronounce, uh, you in the past? Tell me and I, and I will be sure to not do that anymore. Cause one comment I think for, uh, cause one comment I think for Polo is a girl, a girl. Uh, no! <laughs> not a girl, thank you so much for the follow, Ethan Williams, thank you so much, my friend. Okay, I think if I move the chat here, okay. Fanboy for Polo decision made us talking about this. We said you are a girl, and then we continued the gay or European. <laughs> okay, it's time to go back to the church. By going back to the church, we're gonna make a sigil with Grogroth, and on the way, we're gonna we're gonna get tons of things from farming. I actually, use they them, but I never told you because I never thought it was the time to be like um actually, actually what. Oh, <laughs> I understand what you mean with actually, uh, but still, yeah, okay, I I'll be sure, uh, I'll be sure to try to use uh, those, if I forget, uh, or if I use the incorrect ones, please forgive me. Okay, now we have to juke freaking death mask 100 times until we reach the, the entrance of the Dr. Kefir. Also, there is a strange sound. What is this sound? Wait, uh, I've never heard this sound. Uh, bro? Is there a, is there a, oh, shilling. Is there a moon scorch here? What is that sound? It's not Levi. Okay, uh, attack me, because I need to enter Dr. Kefir. Uh, but if you forget, I won't kill you, don't worry. Oh, okay. I don't want to be called a he or a she, but yeah, it's, a uh, they is my, pr my preferred pronoun. Okay, I will try to remember that. What is the sound? Oh, it's just the night host. Uh, no, I'm pretty sure it isn't the night host. I'm pretty sure I've never heard of that sound, actually. But still. Now it's time to take the Lichmonger ring for the future. Also, wait, uh, attack me because I don't want to get stunlocked inside of that place. Already happened uh, inside of the Dr. Kefir place. Here we are. So. Also, guys, remember, tomorrow there is uh, uh, bug fixing of Fear and Anger 1, so if you, if you have some bugs that you want me to review or fix, uh, just uh, let me know, uh, write me on Discord or write on my Discord server. Remember that I have a Discord server, and uh, once again, remember to smash the like button, because at 100 likes, uh, my video, my, my stream is gonna be blessed by YouTube RNG. Sorry, I have to do a little bit of marketing now and then. Because sometimes I have to remember that I have a YouTube channel and I have to do marketing. Tomorrow 20, uh, yeah, exactly, bloody gems. Uh, I mean 20 my time zone, which is uh, GMT plus 2. What is a Discord server? Discord is a uh, social platform and a Discord server is my personal social platform on Discord. 
Fix the butterfly soul, make Samus Snake spaw spawnable. Samus Snake is already spawnable, uh, Janine. I fixed it. Uh, butterfly soul cannot be fixed, because a lot of attacks are certain hits. I don't think... Uh, I think it's easier to not fix the butterfly soul in that case, but I can try to do that. I can try to, to do something, actually. And... Uh, hey! Matthew Hale! Thank you so much for the $10, my friend! How can she run her legs don't work? <laughs> I mean... <laughs> <laughs> you you are right, uh, but uh, that's the funniest part. Imagine, can someone make like a, a meme image or something of uh, uh, Olivia without a wheelchair, literally escaping, uh, and uh, in the image like uh, there is the death mask that stands still after Olivia escapes or something like that. Uh, I would enjoy that a lot. Thank you so much, Matthew Hale, though. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. There it is. Thank you so much, Matthew. All right, we have to juke the umbrellas. This is gonna be difficult. Are they gonna block me? I think I'm able to... D okay, we are fine. We are not gonna go to the moldy apartments. That's endgame. That's uh, absolutely endgame. Who positioned these stupid chairs in this way? Like, uh, this is the worst positioning I've ever seen. Jesus Christ. Okay. Welcome Gustavo. Welcome Gustavo to stream. Non-binary invasion on the bro on the bro walk war. <laughs> I hate these chairs. Like uh, these chairs are incredibly stupid. Like uh, can't you can't you even? Uh, I I would need a um a command to push the chair or something, because in this moment they're just frustrating. Ten shillings. Uh, uh, Dark Raccoon, are there more guaranteed places in which I can get shieldings? Guarant in a guaranteed way, I mean. Otherwise, we will we'll just have to rely on the Pinecone Pig. We have 40 shieldings! Uh, uh, it's gonna be long. I required 2 hours and 20 minutes to get 99 shieldings. So imagine... Uh, I think we need 1 hour to reach... Uh, there are. Tell me where! Tell me where, Dark Raccoon! Tell me where! Please! Or, you know what? No, don't tell me. Uh, like, uh, I'm gonna figure it out, no worries. We can just uh, do trial and error. Red herb... and... Uh, blue vial. That's good, that's good. Now, here there is the... the, the stupid moron that uh, uses the bell. You can do it. Yeah! I imagine it's in all the cash places. I'm gonna start by this one. I think it's a good start. Let's see. Hmm. Let's hope. Uh, I think here there should be like... Oh, maybe there. There is a cache. Please uh, work. Please. Nah. What is Enki pronoun? I think Enki pronoun is he, him. I may be wrong. Ah, uh, okay. This place really is useless. Okay. Also, there are some barrels that I didn't take, uh, bro! I can't wait to be verified on YouTube, yeah. I imagine that's gonna be very nice for you. It's been one month. Uh, oh, they st- All right, it's been one month. It's been more than more than time I required. That's unfortunate. Two shillings, but it's actually one, guys. Remember, when the Pinecone Pig says two shillings, it's actually one shilling because it's bugged. I could have fixed that bug before the stream, but I just said no. It's bugged, we are gonna do it with the bugged version. Okay. Let's enter into the Prohibal Bob to reset the timer, just to be extra sure. Go away, piece of farm reading. <laughs> Wait, there is Nosramus. Where is Nosramus referred uh, as a she? Uh, I do remember, I think uh, Nosramus is referenced as a she, I think. Pep peels! Uh, and oil! That's good. That's good. Oil is very good. Maybe in the Prohibal Bob I can use the cash. Maybe. Hmm. Okay, guys, can you tell me some places in which there is a cache that I can use to get money? Because uh, that is gonna reduce the farming time. And by re and remember, I already spent two hours today doing farming. It's not pleasant, please. <gasps> like, after a certain point, it becomes tedious. Just running to Nosramu Stones, yesterday it's always... Uh, this person has an unclear gender, he is doing this and that. True, like, uh, in the first game there are references to him as uh, he. I don't remember references to uh, she. I think in one point, maybe, one single point. 
Okay, let's go back to the church. How do we go back to the church up here? Here there is a neighbor, right? Or there is nothing? Oh. Uh, I I don't remember anything about this. How did you and Frapolo meet? Uh, if I remember correctly, I met Dark Raccoon. Uh, how was the first... I don't remember... The, how was the first interaction with Dark Raccoon, actually? Let me remember. Do you remember? Yeah, okay, but Dark Raccoon, that's the, the, that's the response that doesn't say anything. How did we actually meet? What was the first inter... I think the first... Uh, the real first interaction was like... Uh, I, I genuinely don't remember. Jesus, this is difficult. Hmm. It's just because of my bad memory. Like, I, I have a very bad memory. And you too, apparently. I, I think... Uh, I think we talked on Discord, but I don't remember about something. I don't remember about what. And I just uh, ran into a circle. Okay, there. There are the infected villagers. I don't need them. I don't need them. For now. It would be cool if someone did speedrun on learning all Hexen in Termina. Maybe someone already did. I don't think there is a Hexen percent, unfortunately, in the speedrun.com categories. That's maybe a good idea, though. I believe you were too shy and decided I just called you and power you up uh, to not be shy. Uh, was it that that reason? I don't remember, genuinely. Uh, th there was one moment in which we discussed something about that, but uh, I don't think it was this moment, but I may be wrong. Hmm. Also, up here, if I remember correctly, there is a... Did we kill Levi or no? I think we didn't. That's a problem. We just need to get one affinity with Growgrowth, then we can go back. 9mm in a chest? Yeah, you can get those. They are useless? Yes. You can get those? Yes. Am I angry of it? Uh, yes. Levi? What is this horrible loot table? Yeah, I would love a ring of braids or something like that. Where is Levi? Oh, oh. Oh, hello, Levi! How are you, my friend? Come here, come here. We're gonna <laughs> join the crawling machine. All right. Goodbye, Levi. You did the video of No Arms Fear and Anger. One story! No arms, uh, fear and hunger. One. All right. Uh, for, maybe I remember. Okay, I'm blocked between the granny and uh, doppelganger Levi. I think I have to kill. Uh, hey. Okay, Levi doesn't have legs. I think I'm gonna use a murky vial to kill him. Yes. I'm gonna pass through here once again, and also I need the head, rifle, stuff, and. Uh, Contestant's head. Now, we can juke the granny. We can juke the granny by using uh, this spot right here. Come over here. Hello? Um. Hello? Ah! Why didn't I escape? I don't want to interact with the granny anymore. You know, I don't. I don't want to interact with the granny anymore. No, 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 no. How do we? Hmm. How do? She has more than ten ten agility. Then, yeah, she probably has fifteen agility. Yeah, something like that. Hmm. Then it's gonna be difficult. I could have I should have used the murky vial on the granny then. Hello? There she is. Can I craft a murky vial? I cannot. Hmm. I have to juke her. Okay? Good job! Good job! Let's go to take Grogrof, then we go back here. Poof! Goodbye, you stupid moron. I think I have to go on the right here. I'm sorry if I'm not looking at the chat in this exact moment, but I was a little bit tense because of the stupid granny. Alright. She's gonna follow me all the way. Uh oh. That's a problem for when I have to pass here once again. But we think about that later. Wait. Oh no, there is the stair. There is no. The ladder, sorry. There is actually no problem. No problem whatsoever. I would reconsider killing Hugo, considering how many times you got blocked. Gold Bros gonna be hell for you. Hmm. The problem is, uh, you you saw what was in front of them all the apartments. Uh, 
I need a way to deal with that stuff. And necromancy seems the only way. Like, having more party members focusable by the enemies seems to be the only way to properly set up Gasoline Canister or Murky Vial. First time here. Welcome, Synthetic Fever. Welcome to stream, my friend. I think the only way to safely set up Murky Vial, Glass Shards, whatever, everything, is using necromancy. Also... Probably I will need to change the title of the stream to Finale Part 1, or something like that. Do all this first, next time you die. Uh, you just need to get mob right, uh, RNG right. Uh, no, because there is there are also Bellens uh, and uh, Fickle Hounds, uh, bloody gems. It's not just the mob. It's literally a boss, a boss rush in the, in the place. There is mob, uh, Fickle Hounds, uh, which are not that difficult, but may end a run if you get bad RNG. It's generally difficult. Bellens uh, are even a problem in this moment. Uh, I was right, the bug fix stream is getting postponed. No, it's not getting postponed, Gecko. It's still gonna be tomorrow. The thing that is gonna get postponed is the real finale of this run. Do you understand what I mean? Okay. We are just... We are almost arrived to the church. All this detour was done in order to make the Grog of Sigil in the church because we need one level of affinity in order to get uh, Necromancy. Going full attack on Titan. No wheelchair finale season one part two. <laughs> exactly. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do finale part one. Finale part two. Finale part three part one. Finale part three part two. <laughs> it's gonna be funny. Jesus, guys, you have no idea how sad I am that we have to wait till September freaking for uh, um, the final, final, final part of Attack on Titan. Jesus. Lobotomy Corporation does score deal finale. I mean, if I get the new PC, yes. If I get the new PC, I could generally do the Dusk or DL. Generally. We, n we now know how to deal with the, the uh, nothing there, which is an Aleph uh, ab abnormality. Wait, it's still going. Uh, what, Macobel? You mean Attack on Titan? Yeah, it's still going. No, uh, the, the manga ended, but I still didn't read the manga. And uh, I'm, uh, I'm, in, um, I'm keeping up with the anime. I'm waiting for the final part. Who's your favorite uh, SNK char character? SNK? What is SNK, Crimson Kalo? Going to force a friend to play the first game blind. Take care. All right. Uh, good. Uh, thank you so. Uh, thank you so much for telling me, Janine Cat. Uh, hope you'll be able to <clears throat> force your friend to play it. He, he will not. Re uh, your friend will not regret it afterwards. Okay. After traversing all the whole world in order to get back to the church, we should be able to set up the Grogu of Sigil. I think we only need one. Yeah, I don't need to go to the other place. I don't need to go to the other place. I don't need to go to the Major's Manor. One is more than enough. Here we are. Mullis, no. Yeah, Mullis was already dead. Mullis died in literally the second episode of this stream. <laughs> like, imagine, Mullis died in the second episode. From the second episode to here, the progresses I made were reaching Prohibal Bop. And that's it. Jesus. All right, here we are. Uh, was it uh, one floor? I think it was one. F no, the church is two F. Sorry, two F. Two F. Two F. What are we doing now? Welcome, Pupra Blatia. We are going back to the uh, uh, asymmetric circle because I need affinity with Grogroth. After that, we go back into the orphanage. Farm for 99 shillings, we are already at like 40 or something. And after that, we buy the Hardened Heart and smash Father Hugo. That's the gist of what I want to do. Black Souls is really vanilla though. I mean, it depends. If you are if you are used to H games, Black Souls is vanilla. Like if we compare, I don't know, Black Souls to Lona RPG, okay, Black Souls is absolutely vanilla. But it's not like completely vanilla. Let's say it like that. Okay. Grogor of Affinity. Let's go. Is Fear and Anger harder than the first game? In my opinion, it isn't harder than the first game, Synthetic Fever. In my opinion, Fear and Anger 1 is harder than the second one. For the same for the uh, only reason that in the second game you have plenty of opportunities to get party members. In the first game you have only uh, niche party members in the form of necromancy, or the normal party members are only three. 
and to get them uh, there is only one that is easy to get which is Darcy the others uh, are complex Lona RPG is very hardcore yeah exactly Lona RPG is very hardcore I agree Lona isn't erotic in the least it's just suffering and <laughs> I mean as uh, Lona RPG has a good gameplay in my opinion a very good gameplay what is Lona? Uh, there is, uh, uh, search it only if you want to throw up or something because it's very cruel as a game. Yeah, I have a playthrough on the channel. Is uh, age restricted because of the fact that uh, <laughs> there is no way Lona RPG is gonna not be age restricted. Rack would be easy if it didn't bug out. Uh, Rack doesn't bug out. What do you mean, Shmo? Does Rack bug out? When does Rack bug out? Tell me. Tomorrow I have a bug fixing stream. Tell me uh, when does Rack bug out? I'm gonna fix it. Complex Ragnavaldo is, is easy as fuck to recruit with some luck. Yeah, exactly. And there is a guaranteed. I mean, okay, the new player will not know there is a guaranteed vial, but still, if you get a vial, you have immediate access to him. Literally. All right. Now. How many shieldings do we have? Wait, 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 41, we need 58 shieldings. And we already consumed all those present inside of the cache thing. I think we are gonna farm for those, also because I need some healing items. Wait! Oh, okay, the, I did keep the small things amulet. For a second I thought I didn't. With the guaranteed vial, you might as well get the uh, get Kahara too. Uh, yeah, exactly, I mean, I mean, if you interacted with him in the prisons. If you interacted with him in the prisons, and potentially new players are not gonna open the cell in the prison. Potentially. Am I going in the correct way? Uh, yeah, yeah. Enki is ass to recruit, yeah. Enki, th there is no way a new player that never played the game is gonna be able to recruit Enki. No, no freaking way. It's seriously more easy that they are able to completely reach the end of ending B than to recruit Enki. There is no way that you're gonna talk to the yellow mage like that and that you're gonna get the Eclipse Talisman and after that uh, you get Anki in the basement. No, no. Like, uh, this, this is like one of those Minecraft achievements uh, that are like uh, impossible to know if you ever, ever played the game. F like, uh, getting Anki as a party member is like literally playing Minecraft without Wikipedia, without knowing the recipes, without anything. It's something like that, at least. It's H game YouTuber. Who? Oh. <laughs> Darcy is the easiest, but the flip side of that is the easiest area becomes tough. I mean, tough, yeah. If you don't know how to deal with the Cave Dwellers, it is tough. If you know that you have only to defeat the arm with the rock, and potentially you may understand that because uh, you can see, oh, they have a rock in the hand. You have to destroy that, otherwise they're gonna deal damage to me. If you do that, uh, they are just pushovers. The only problems are those with the spear, but uh, problem. They're gonna deal some damage to you, that's it. I don't expect someone to die against uh, a guy with a spear. Like, uh, guys, genuinely, tell me, who is there someone here in the chat that in Fear and Hunger 1 died against a cave dweller? I don't think someone in the chat died against a cave dweller. I mean, getting a game over from a cave dweller. There is no freaking web Julia? How did you were, were you bl were you blindfolded when you played? How did you Dark Raccoon No Dark Raccoon that's <laughs> Guys You really got killed by the cave dwell <laughs> Really? Ah Oh that that's unexpected. I wasn't expecting all of you dying because of cave Really I don't think I did from them Margravaldo missed a hand. Oh, missed. The... Mm. Okay. Yeah. In hard mode, it's reasonable. Then I guess in hard mode, it's reasonable because you can miss that. That's true. No, the granny. We have to juke her. We have to juke her. Just to be extra sure, I'm gonna. Eat the mixed herbs like right here that give 50 health. I know it gives regen, but no worries, we are gonna farm regardless, so we're gonna get more stuff. Eat more. Are you fine? Okay, the granny is going back. Right. Okay, we can pass safely. No! 
Okay. Goodbye, you stupid run killer bozo. Goodbye. Goodbye. Ah. It's not granny, it's mutant rat. All right, it's old lady. Wait, actually, old lady. Also, I didn't die to the blue people. It was a meme. Oh, okay, okay. But you seem uh, a, pe a person that could die to the blue people, actually. I don't think you were lying. I think after saying that, you just felt sad and wanted to retract that. As, as for my first run, I played as Darcy. Uh, I played as Darcy. I killed the Summon Snake with Moolis, uh, wore the crown and didn't even know. Oh, <laughs> the Dwellers can attack, yeah. You died to Harvest Man. I, everyone, I think uh, everyone here actually died to the Harvest Man. I think that's a reasonable death. And with reasonable, I mean uh, it's p potentially unskippable in a, in a gameplay. I think. Uh, wait, uh, why did he stop moving? Bro. I think. Uh, Salmos, um, Harvestman is impossible to not get to not die against the Harvestman. I never died to a Harvestman. I don't. I don't believe that. I'm sorry. I'm asking because I think Fionnager also has a huge Russian fan base. That's true. Sometimes I receive Russian comments under my videos. I love that. I loved being so near to the Russian community as well as being near to the Italian and English community. That's one of my favorite parts of the of having a, the channel, you know. Uh, actually, I could have gone. I could have gone to the infected people from here now. Nah, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. We just have to juke the stupid umbrellas. I swear, if I die because of the chairs. If I die because of the chairs, uh, no, no, no. Okay. We're fine. Greetings from Spain. Oh, nice, Crimson Cal. Nice. Uh, even Spain. We have all the press to run Sean. I'm these guys. <laughs> okay, now it's the moment of the stream that I hoped was never arriving. We have to farm. And the reason I wanted it to not arrive is because uh, I already farmed a lot. But I guess it's inevitable. Uh, bro? Okay. The death mask is so freaking fast. Sorry, my demon strap, I found a brother? <laughs> what? Okay, attack me because I don't want to get bugged on Dr. Kefir entrance. Lucky coin! Here we are, Dr. Kefir. We don't, uh, we can't uh, buy anything with these shillings. Uh, let's go. Destination, sewers. Actually, I could farm in the Orphanage. I think it's also easier to farm in the Orphanage. I can set up if we're going to eat. No, I did eat. What do you mean, Dark Raccoon? I did eat. I did eat. I don't have the 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 food uh, the food status effect anymore. Wait, uh, he can come on the on the stairs. Oh, so he bugs when he doesn't. Okay. So you can follow me all the way to the Orphanage. So I have to be careful here because the guy with the bell and the death mask can actually stun lock me to death. I have to be very careful to them. Are you able to enter the orphanage, death mask? No, he can come uh, like a come uh, coming to the stairs. <laughs> Whatever. I'm not gonna talk. If I talk, everything can be used against me. I'm not gonna talk, nighty night. <laughs> Here we are! And there was Needles! I heard it for a second. Guy with Bell is Inquisitor. Yeah, Inquisitor. I, I never remember the names of these enemies. I don't know why. Okay, I want to talk, I want to make a discussion, guys. Do you agree with me when I say that uh, enemies... Uh, Non-boss enemies in the second game are less memorable than enemies in the first game? Like... Uh, I don't know why. Maybe it's just because I played it less. But I still think, like, uh, Inquisitor, uh, Cherubs, uh, they're not, like, uh, memorable names. He said I will always know, oh, those are the cave dwellers, this is uh, this thing, uh, you know. Bosses in Chu are awesome. In fact, in fact I'm saying uh, non-boss enemies, Raccoon. Non-boss enemies aren't memorable. Like in the first game, the guard. Or, uh, I don't know, freaking Body Snatcher, or uh, Red Man, 
All of them are very memorable, look. It's because there are less enemies in the first one. Maybe, yeah, maybe Kreia, do you have a point? Maybe you do have a point. But they still, uh, I don't know. It's strange. Also, wait, uh, I think it's time to put the farming music. Let me put something else. Where is the Spamton theme? I can't find it. Oh, it's on the desktop. Uh, I have the Spamton theme here. There it is. All right. It's time to farm. Not boss enemies are good emo. I remember getting one shot by an octopus. One? Huh? An octopus? Which octopus is present here? I don't remember an octopus. What is the today's conversation, lads? Yeah, now we're talking about the memorability of enemies. Keep Darcy uh, gonna bust out Darcy moves at any moment. <laughs> Do shares have clipper we clip wings? Uh? I don't know. Don't think so. Wait. Uh, they have uh, a cat on their body. That may be the wings. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Now they, they are much more scary than before. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, let's try to make a bet. I'm gonna make a bet. How much we will... Ha how much time... How long will we take? How long will the farm last? 30 means... 1 hour... Or 2... Uh, no, 1 and a half hours... Or 2 hours... I'm really curious what you guys think. Two weeks. You have a lot of possibilities, guys. Okay, 30 minutes is we 30 minutes is winning. Okay, 1.5 hours seems more reasonable. Wait, maybe I can improve this strat. Wait. If I get stun locked by them. The farming may be improved. I think. And Zionis, thank you so much for the $10. I would like to make an announcement. Monster girls are based. And I want to be wrapped around the Lamia. I'll be like a Ragni... A Ragni... A Ragni... Vanil. But instead of slaying monsters. <laughs> I mean, I, 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 uh, I respect absolutely your opinion. Yeah, monster girls are based and I agree with that. Thank you so much, Zionis. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much, my friend. Okay, this way I don't even need to kill. Uh, to, to, to click, sorry. I'm gonna enter in the fight automatically. I improved it. If only I had a way to automatically click run. This could literally be auto farming. I could like set up a macro or something. Shilling! That's one less shilling required. Welcome, Rupa! Welcome, Rupa. Okay, you guys are saying I will need two hours to get 50 shillings. You guys have no, you guys have no idea what you're talking about. I got 99 shillings in literally half of that time. No, I mean, I got 99 shillings in two hours, right? But uh, I'm, I think I'm gonna require one hour for uh, the half of 99. God of Rule Treff. <laughs> If you are in a bed between Darcy and Ragnavaldor, who do you face? Uh, Darcy? No, wait, uh, wait, uh, no! <laughs> that's a problem! That's a that's a big problem, Crimson Caleb. If I face Darcy, Ragnavaldor may be... <laughs> no, 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 no! <laughs> but if I face Ragnavaldor... Uh... No, I, 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 I smash the bed and go sleep outside, okay? That's what I do. I destroy the bed and go and go sleep outside. <laughs> you trapped me. <laughs> you did a you did a trick question. I wasn't prepared for that. So you say Ragnavaldo is more dangerous than Darcy? Uh, Gecko, from a lore perspective, yes. Ragnavaldo is more dangerous than Darcy. From a gameplay wise, uh... Ragnavaldo is a joke. Trap, you need to farm more. Let me explain, Rupa. At the start, I was already prepared with all the stuff needed, but then I died because I'm stupid. So I lost two hours of farming. So now we are gonna... <laughs> we are gonna farm until I get something good. I also need some herbs for healing, so I would have needed to farm regardless. And because of that, I guess we will... 
Today we are gonna kill Father Hugo. Be sure about that. He pinched the guard three times and he died. <laughs> you wouldn't like me when I'm hungry, Fapol. I, I wouldn't like you. What do you mean? What do you do when you're hungry? Are you different from the usual? Yeah, I like Ragnavalder Carter too in the um, in the lore aspect. In the gameplay aspect, though, it's very lackluster. What do what does Rag do when he's angry? Uh, he eats you. <laughs> Imagine. Like, uh, Ragnavalder uh, hungry may be really a problem, also because... Uh, imagine, th imagine like this uh, inside of the dungeon. Literally, after you defeat the Crow Molar of a guard, he literally takes the Crow Molar head and, uh, and bites it, and uh, eats the whole Crow Molar. It's very disturbing if you think about it uh, from, that, from that point of view. Then if you go to look at Ragnavalder gameplay, it's terrible. If you like the lore aspect, you should read the abnormality stories. All of them are incredibly sad. Yeah, in the past I, I did read all the abnormalities that I got. I stopped now because I'm trying to focus more on the gameplay than on the story. But later I may fo I may read their stories, yeah. How about Crow's Molar? <laughs> also, I would need to take some water. I finished the water! Uh. Okay guys, wait me one second. I'm gonna take the water. so fast. I almost fell. I, sl I almost slipped on the floor. <laughs> ah. Ah. Okay. We're fine. I need to... Actually, I have an idea. Wait a second. I have an idea. Uh, controls. Uh, four... No. Uh, what is a good command? A. A is gonna be moved down. Move down, I have to... Wait, I have to click. No, no, no. I have to click cancel... Uh, it's X, actually. Uh, cancel menu, okay. S is gonna be move down, and D is gonna be... Okay. So if I enter the battle, and I click this... Okay. It seems to work. Oh, but I still need to keep this one uh, down. Okay. It's working. It's not cheating. I'm uh, I'm optimizing it, so I don't have to click uh, 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 very very far uh, buttons. Shilling. It's one less shilling required. Uh, you're trapped in the dungeon of Fanger. You only can choose one card to help you, but that card is his canon version, not his gameplay one. Oh, hmm. Of course, that's a that's a good question. I think... Uh, wait, if I'm trapped in the dungeon of Fear and Anger, potentially there is a locked door. And if there is a locked door, I think the best choice would be Kahara. Also because Kahara can easily juke the enemies, etc. I, I would go with Kahara. Like, Kahara is a mercenary. He's supposed to be able to deal with this type of situations against very powerful enemies. So. I don't think uh, um, the others would be able to effectively dodge everyone. So I say Kahara. Now Ragnavaldor, uh, the problem with Ragnavaldor is I think during the combat he's pretty uh, berserk, okay? And while he's berserk I'm afraid that he may make me, he may put me in danger. That's why I don't want to, to choose him. Ragnavaldor was the only one sane enough to bring a ranged weapon with him. <laughs> yeah, and that's the worst weapon ever! Because arrows deal bad damage. I mean, uh, if you take an incredibly muscular guard of the dungeon, even if you shoot at him with an arrow, it's not like it's gonna die with that shoot. You're gonna very, very, very slowly, like, uh, block him or something, but uh, it's still gonna be there. It's not like he's gonna disappear. Also, wait, uh, if I keep this one... Okay! I need to click only two buttons. The other two can, can, be, uh, can be hold. No, not anymore. 
Wait, uh, what if... Uh, let me see... No, okay. Uh, false, false. I still need to click uh, three buttons in order to do this. Uh, they can one-shot elite guards. Uh, yeah, Commissar, yeah. But, uh, like, uh, that's only a gameplay thing. You guys said lore-wise. Lore-wise, you're not gonna one-shot a uh, elite guard. So, like, you're not gonna be able to really do something with uh, Ragnavalder. ETA on, blue, on Bloodlust only? ETA? What is ETA? What does ETA mean? I've never heard that acronym. Is it an acronym or something? Let me drink. I took the water. It's time to drink, guys. Are you ready? Wait. Ah, it was still closed. Okay. <sighs> Expected time of arrival, ETA. Oh. Oh, early, earliest time available? About what? Also, why isn't the W command working anymore? Okay, now it works. Uh, Lorewise, Rag killed all the monsters with his bow. I mean... Uh, I don't believe that... Nah, nah, there, there is no way. Ragnavalder is not gonna be able to do that, nah. He's not that strong. Also, no, wait, uh, how did he sew off the head of the uh, Iki Torso with a bow? You cannot sew off the head with a bow. He definitely used an axe for that. Wait, uh, where did you... Where... <laughs> he killed them with items only. <laughs> with items only! <laughs> like, the point... No, I didn't want to go down. The point I want to do is... Uh, I think... Uh, Ragnavaldor is not that strong to be able to do that. Uh, bro? Why isn't the other one looking at me anymore? Uh, notice me! Hello? Bro! You're supposed to attack me! I feel... I feel discarded! Hey! Bro! Where are you going, bro? Bro? Okay, I'm gonna take the other one. I need two for this method of farming. Come on. Okay, here is one, and here is two. Cherub gave you a cold shoulder. <laughs> okay, should be able to uh, set up the farmer once again. That was a really bad moment. I felt, uh, I felt denied from the lead of the cherub. On the topic of picking the character, why would you pick uh, our lovable Merc? Uh, Lorewise, he would most likely betray you or leave you for dead when things go bad. I mean, Gabe, uh, true, but uh, if I promise him uh, uh, some money or something like that, I guess he's gonna be able to help me. Like, uh, uh, he betrays the party members uh, at the start or at the end uh, if you don't give him the crown. So, if you give him the crown, or whatever, you give him some money, he's gonna help you. He's a mercenary, literally. So, I don't see why not. He could just steal from you. Pumpkin, inside a dungeon with dangerous creatures, you're not gonna be that angry to steal from a sane person. What would be my class? My class? I think my class would either be the Dark Priest or the Mercenary. There is no way I am skilled enough in combat to be the, the knight, and there is no way I'm, I'm, uh, I have enough muscles to be Ragnavalder. There is no way. Kahara is definitely a snake. Huh? Miasma would, uh, sword is the only friend you need. I mean, yeah, if you have the, the Miasma sword, you won't need other friends. You won't have other friends, but you won't need other friends, yeah. You're right. Also. Uh, I wanted to ask something, guys. Uh, so, uh, let's... Uh, sorry if, if I talk for a second about this, uh, but uh, let me let me explain. So, I have to decide uh, if I want to wait. I'm also gonna make a poll on this. Let me explain beforehand. So, my new PC uh, has to come. It's still not assembled. The guy told me either I wait a certain amount of time that is still not specified for an, a 12 core, or... He's gonna, he's gonna build me, before the end of the week, a uh, 8-core. Now, my point is, uh, uh, of course the 12-core is better than the 8-core. The problem is, uh, do you think I should wait, uh, or should I take the 8-core? 
I already have a, de a possible answer, but I want to see what you what you guys think about it. Uh, what should I do? Wait uh, for 12 core or take 8 core. Like 8 core was good. Uh, like 8 core is able to run the majority of the uh, currently existing games. Uh, the, the point is, uh, like, uh, you guys are saying wait for 12 core, really? The point is, uh, like, uh, on an 8 core, uh, games such as Elden Ring run no problem. The point is, uh, is the 12 core that more useful? Go big or go home. Yeah, but the problem is I would need to wait at least one week, potentially two. I want to play Lobotomy Corporation, uh, Elden Ring. I want to play that stuff. When uh, can you get the 12? Uh, Shmo, at the moment it's not specified. It may be uh, two weeks, it may be one month. It's still not specified. Like, uh, I could uh, I could take the 8 core and then selling it once I take the 12 core, no? Like, uh, 8 core uh, seems... Uh, I know 4 core advantage, but... Uh, uh, like, I was talking with someone on, the di someone on the Discord, he told me some games are not even gonna be able to use all the cores uh, simultaneously. If you want to play Lobotomy Corporation, fix the, fix the memory leaks sorted. That's... no, that's not the only problem. Lobotomy Corporation also made my PC overheat a lot. I think that's another reason for which the game crashed. Any plans for a food consumables guide? Uh, on Termina or on the first game? Because I, I don't think it's needed. Hmm... But I'm, uh, your Mundur, I may think about it since you're mentioning. You have to understand that PC is gonna stick with you for a while, so take it. Take it. The 12 core or uh, the, the 8 core? It's just two weeks, so we can wait. I, I know you can wait, but I can't wait. I want to have it. I can just change the core uh, in the future, no? And then I can sell the old, the, the, the old parts. Hmm... Go for the 12 core a week uh, is nothing. Uh, I don't know... We will see. Because uh, tomorrow he, uh, he's gonna call me and we will see what happens. Uh, I think I'm gonna take the, the 8 core though. I, f I think I'm gonna take the 8 core. But we will see. Why are you so impatient? Gecko, you know how long I waited for a new PC? This PC wasn't even supposed to be mine for this much time. I've been waiting for a lot of time, Gecko. Don't say I'm impatient. You are literally talking with someone that is farming with Pinecone Pig. And you dare tell me that I'm impatient. You dare tell me that I'm impatient? Are you certain you're not being scammed? Yeah, 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 it's a... Uh... It's a certified band, or like a, 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 it's guaranteed that it's not gonna. I still didn't give money, so I'm still secured. Uh, wait for the 12 core. Black Souls 3 will need all 13 of them. I will throw money at you. Take the 12 core. What do you mean you will throw money at me? <laughs> then it's not that big of a deal to wait just one week more. I I know, but I want to have it. I want to have it. Like talking to a uh, to a down bad friend talking about his ex coming to town, like that I'm saying, uh, uh, should I visit or should I not, should I not visit the the girl? Talk according to Steam record and play big stuff. Hmm, I will think about it. I will think about it because uh, in the current moment, uh, I'm I'm fairly certain I will take the eight core. I can just change it in the future, like a. Uh, I generally don't think uh, the difference will be that big. Uh, even the guy that is responsible, that is uh, s that is should assemble me the PC, told me the difference is gonna is big, but uh, uh, the cur the current eight core is already able to do all the stuff that you may need. Sorry for my doubts. Best to be safe. Do you want uh, do you want to have the exact problem you're having now in four or six years? Uh, just an example. Yeah, in four or six years uh, is um, no even two or three years. Can be changing the core in two or three years seems fine to me. Only wants an upgrade because he wants to play Ko Koikatsu. What is Koikatsu? I would go for the eight core, uh, especially if you can change it later. Plus, later CPUs uh, could drop in price and such. Hmm. Uh, we will see. 
I still want to value even the part of the chat that is saying that he should take the 12 core. I will think about this more. CPU are a bitch like that since they require... Oh, shillings! How many shillings do we have? What's up with the two layers of music? Uh, one is the... Wait, actually... No, I'm not gonna remove the Termina music. One is the music that I made, that I put in the game, Mihailo Petrovic. The other one is the one of the Termina, because we are farming, so we are just chilling. I'm right with chat, it would not be a big difference, but it's a lot better if you want, uh, if you wait some weeks. You need patience. Mm. We will see. I run everything 144 FPS on a 6 course. 144! Bro! Oh. Why do something halfway now when you can have a more lasting solution in no time? More lasting solution. I don't expect the, the 12 core to last way longer than the 8 core. Like, uh, the difference is gonna be, is gonna be, the difference, as I said, is big, but uh, come on, 8 core can run uh, Elden Ring. It's not like uh, in two years there's gonna be a new, a new crazy game that lags on an 8 core or something. Or at least I don't think so. You can farm off camera while waiting. <laughs> CPU needs to be right for motherboard, so you might not be able to change CPU later to 12 core without changing a lot of other stuff too. Hmm. Can you pull if you should install the memory leak fixing mode for Love Atomic Corporation? I'm probably gonna install it, Destruction, so no worries. It will last pretty much uh, the same. Okay. Hmm. What about you don't buy 12 cores? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's that, that's the question I'm making to the chat, exactly, Puniatum. Did you ever need to say to change cores? Uh, 12 cells for more. Hmm. So you, you're telling me I'm gonna have difficulties in trying someone that wants to buy an 8 core. I think. Like, a, I, also, the, the other reason is uh, I really want to have the 8 core because at the current moment, uh, when I try to edit videos and stuff, uh, the PC is very laggy. It happened to me multiple times that I completely lost my editing progress because of a freaking crash of the program. Or, even when I'm recording, sometimes it happens that uh, Streamlabs just decides to close himself. Let me ask you something, would you like $1 now or $5 in 20 minutes? Same principle. $1 now. <laughs> I win! <laughs> It's only a week. I know it's a week, but uh, you have no idea the amount of stuff I accumulated on my PC that needs to be edited. Dollar now, exactly. <laughs> hmm. I'm gonna take into... Okay, guys, I'm gonna take into consideration what you guys uh, are saying about the 12th course. I'm gonna take absolutely into consideration, I swear. I'm gonna think more about it afterwards. Before uh, giving the before uh, giving my decision to the to the guy, because the problem, from what I understood, is uh, he doesn't find a motherboard compatible with the 12 cores. Like uh, I would need to wait because he doesn't find uh, a motherboard compatible. <laughs> Ryan, <laughs> thank you so much for the one pound, my friend. Pound, I think that's called pound, right? Thank you so much, my friend. I really appreciate that. You asked for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like it. Thank you so much, Ryan. Are you close to a circle to save after the farm? After the farm, we have to defeat Father Hugo. Then we have to defeat uh, all the three effigies we have to take. After that, we have to defeat Circle. After that, we can save. Easy! Guys, he's going to come back tomorrow with the 8 core. One dollar now on... Uh, uh, or on a random day, fifty dollars. <laughs> random uh, is more interesting. It may be even sooner. Okay, random day, fifty dollars. I guess in that mo in that case, uh, because a random isn't ex it isn't specified when. Like if you say two weeks, it seems a lot of time. But if you say in a random moment between now and two weeks uh, from now, it may even be tomorrow or in a second. You know what I mean? Deal, Mister Frapo. No, wait. Uh, you were serious. <laughs> <laughs> like if you say random, it's uh, it's more interesting. If you have fifty-three, 
Wait, we only got like 13 in all this time. What do you mean? We're not gonna be able to get all uh, all done for today, right? I had something like that when I used the blender, but it was because of my fault. Maybe you do also made too much uh, detail, and because of that your PC crashed. Mm, I don't know. Like I tried to make uh, out of out of uh, uh, cat and uh, zoom and something like that when I make a, an editing. One dollar now or a chance at either plus ten dollars or minus ten dollars. Uh, I refuse to answer the question, Pistachios. What if you guys tell you he's got the motherboard for the current uh, 12 in 3 days? Uh, oh, of course I'm fine with that. 3 days is nothing. 2 weeks uh, is uh, is very bad. Yo, Frapchat, welcome Napoleon! What do you prefer, the CPU or the mystery box? There may be a CPU inside. Mystery box. I know it's a very messed up, uh, messed up uh, reasoning, I know. That one dollar now or 50 in 2 weeks sounds like a heads or tail moment. Yeah, I like uh, those moments. Uh, instead of putting uh, all the regular Lydia runs into one video, just put them into a playlist tapes. Uh, you were re um, uh, re-rendering a 16 hour video! <laughs> 16 hour video! No, no, no. In time, you can in time you wait, you can play other games. Uh, no, Gecko, because Lobotomy Corporation crashes. Darkest Dungeon 2 doesn't work. And freaking Elden Ring is completely out of reach. The point is that the guy might get the right motherboard before two weeks, it's usually the max time what they tell you. No, 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 he told me f at least two weeks, but uh, he still didn't tell me if that's the case. If it's not that case, then it's gonna be in one or two days, and he's gonna tell me tomorrow, from what I understood. Tomorrow he's gonna tell me if I have to wait two or more weeks or not. I No, I don't want to play something else, I don't want to... Uh, space my content so much. I want to... First, uh, I want to finish uh, uh, some f some stuff before moving to new stuff, like uh, I want to finish Lobotomy before going to other stuff. One dollar now or... Uh, uh, one dollar now, Mihailo Petrovic. One dollar now. I don't care about your 12 cores. <laughs> it's fine if you don't care, Puniatum, but now we're talking about it, so deal with it. I'm back after six coming my bones, so welcome back, holy for day, sir. Come on, we only need some, uh, uh, like, uh, 40 more shieldings. Uh, let me drink. <sighs> Finish lobotomy. Yeah, I think I'm pretty near the end. Uh, why are you getting a lobotomy? No, lobotomy corporation, seven evenism. <laughs> I'm not getting a lobotomy. I am playing lobotomy corporation. Finishing Lobotomy is a long, long-term goal? What do you mean? Uh, one Pago Pig now and unlimited items in five hours. <laughs> yeah. Also. Okay, we have one, another oil. That's very good. We may also craft another mixed herbs, but I guess for now we can just wait those. For Paul is getting lobotomized. <laughs> Jesus, is gonna be so painful. Thank you so much for the follow. Who is it? Uh, Marco Doom 64 Thank you so much, my friend. One dollar now or Pinecon Pig IRL? Pinecon Pig. Pinecon Pig. Pinecon Pig. One Marina now and unlimited soul stones in one hour. So, okay. <laughs> like, uh, another shilling. The thing I'm saying is... Uh, I'm, a, I'm a patient person, but uh, in some things I'm not. Literally. I'm patient only in certain things, such as, uh, I don't know, uh, in this case, uh, the farming uh, uh, for uh, shieldings. Uh, I'm patient. The PC? No! We have 20 plus hours of Lobotomy Corporation left, and that's a generous estimate. 20 plus hours? I mean, yeah. I'm expecting 20 plus hours. So that's what I mean when I say I want to finish it. I mean, I mean, it's gonna require at least one more month of playing with the streams. So, Golden Chanterelle, that's good. I'm not saying uh, I'm at the end game, but I'm saying uh, 20 plus hours is not uh, something too, too bad. Like for me, a lot of time is 80 hours. Do you guys know how long, uh, I mean, uh, if you guys play the Persona, Persona 3 or 4 or 5, uh, you know how long those games are. Do you know how many gameplays I have on Persona 5? 5. 
I have five gameplays of Persona 5. One, which is my first one. The second one in which I just abused the hell out of uh, all the stuff that I already had, and I defeated the twins. The third one uh, was, I think, uh, uh, the first one I demanded was on Merciless, so the, the second one I tried other difficulties. The fourth one I don't even remember what I did. I think I just uh, randomly tried to make uh, different builds with the Joker persona. And then in the fifth one it was just a nostalgia because Persona 5 Royal came out and I played that version. The fifth one was Persona 5 Royal. Did you stream Elden Ring off of that Microsoft game streaming service? I don't think so, Mortal One. I only complete Persona 3 like three times. Persona 3! Persona 3 I completed it uh, two times, uh, but in those two times I, sp I think I spent uh, more than double the time of Persona 5 because I wanted to see everything. And I, love g I loved grinding into the Tartarus. Grinding into the Tartarus was the best thing ever. A lot of people hate the Tartarus, I love it. I freaking love it. And Persona 4, I played it only one time, because it's my... Like, uh, the characters are good, but uh, it's my least favorite one. Between these three. It's still good, but it's my least favorite guy. Uh, my still favorite one. One playthrough of Arcol uh, Arcolos took me 130 hours. Ooh. 69 playthroughs of Persona 5 Strikers. No, only one on Strikers. Because, um, no wait, uh, I mean, uh, one plus the, the new game plus uh, in the in the higher unlocked difficulty because I wanted to plat to to get the platinum on it. I don't keep, I don't think it's called Tartarus. It is called Tartarus, the big tower in Persona 3. Yeah. Are you gonna stream Persona 6 uh, if it comes out before the next century? Of course. Uh, I would love streaming Persona 6. Uh. Jesus, that would be a dream. That would generally be a dr one of my dreams. Being able to stream Persona 6. How are you guys going? Welcome, Apenas EU. We are trying to get 99 shillings to get the heart and heart. And we are getting a lot of shillings now. Is hardest difficulty actually playable without the bug spots, items, party members, and if so, how? Uh, your Mundur, uh, the first game. Yeah! It's actually playable. I, I also have a stream in which I played it with both Enki and Ragnavaldor. And uh, I also completed the game using item only in the higher difficulty. Will you play Bloodborne? Uh, I don't think so, Destruction, because I already played it. So I don't think my approach would generally be interesting to see, because I would just be more technical and mechanical. I feel I would be more heartless if I tried to, ble to bring Bloodborne, because I already know a lot about... Uh, Good builds, uh, where to go, where to take stuff. Uh, welcome, Nettle! Welcome to stream, my friend! What will come out first, Elder, Cross, Elder, Elder Scrolls 6 or Persona 6? I think uh, Persona 6, honestly. Like, uh, Bloodborne could generally be... Could generally... Uh, if I bring Bloodborne, I could generally not be the same as bringing, I don't know, Lobotomy Corporation or Fear and Anger. Uh, talking about Heartless, uh, yeah. Have you fought the Heartless one? Oh, I already defeated the Heartless... Not in this run, uh, Puniatum. In this run, we are not gonna face the Heartless one. But yeah, I did face the Heartless one, and it's pretty doable. Pretty easy, actually. When you play Blo uh, Bloodborne, do you have a, a PS4? I do have a PS4 destruction. On the PS4, I have uh, Dark Souls 3, Bloodborne, uh, uh, Nier Automata, uh, Final Fantasy VII Crisis Core Reunion, Final Fantasy VII Remake. Uh, I love my PS4. I bought it with the... there was a bundle with the PS4 plus Dark Souls 3 and when I bought it I specifically wanted to play Dark Souls 3 so I, I was literally crying when I saw the bundle. What type of build would Frap use on Elder Ring? I should opt for a fat juicy strength build. I don't know, the first approach I take to an, an, a Souls game usually is I want to experiment. So even if it ruins my build, I just want to drop random numbers on uh, the, the statistic that increases spell usage and the statistic that increases miracle, because I want to test stuff. Like, uh, in my very first playthrough of Dark Souls 1, I finished at level 120, and I had uh, half of Havel equipment equipped on me, and I also was able to use spells. You should still be able to play Elder Ring then, no need for PS5. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Once I get my new PC, I'll surely be able to. Yeah, 120 my first play for da of Dark Souls. I loved going around just messing up with enemies. 
I didn't even grind on purpose. I literally went around and defeated stuff. I enjoyed it a lot. Dark Souls is one of the few games in which I generally enjoyed, enjoyed just going around and defeating enemies for the whole purpose of it. Did New Game Plus with the same dude? Yeah, New Game Plus. I, my second gameplay of Dark Souls was also with the same dude from Dark Souls uh, from the first run. Yeah. Respects are quite plentiful in Elden Ring, so you'll be fine to experiment. I believe you get six respects around. Or oh, respects is like being able to reassign the statistics. Okay, okay. Yeah, the farming is still going on, Afri. We need 99 shieldings. We are not joking here. 99. Let me drink. What builds do you usually go for in the Souls games? The first character is always an experiment. I go uh, Stamina, uh, Magic and Miracles. Then after that run, I either do... Um, uh, uh, so, uh, like uh, melee weapons only, and so I, I increase a lot of health and stamina and something like that. Or I go for a mage only build, and I literally only use uh, intelligence. Like uh, I have like uh, a couple of save files uh, on on my Dark Souls on Steam, with literally only statistics uh, on uh, intelligence. I literally, I'm literally able to, like, uh, three-shot uh, all the endgame bosses with it. I love it. How much shielding, sir? Let me check. Uh, I, I said let me check. Okay. Uh, 62. We are missing 37. I hope that wasn't too spoilerish. Uh, you will need to get it to a certain point in the game to start respacing. Yeah, no worries. It wasn't really a spoiler. I mean, Dark Souls 2 already does it, uh, so... Huh? What is this? Uh, what's that is going up doing this? Uh, first time watching the second game. Welcome to Mulligan. Uh, this may be a bad approach uh, as a first approach to the second game because uh, we are we are doing a challenge run. There is uh, the hardest difficulty which is called Mazo Mode uh, and uh, Olivia is a character that can play without a wheelchair. We are doing Mazo Mode wheelchairless. Uh, welcome to stream by the way. Hope you managed to play Dark Souls one day. Uh, I already played that. Oh, you're talking so with someone else. Okay. In Bloodborne, uh, I loved using uh, the Sacred Sword of Ludwig. Sacred Sword of Ludwig is my favorite weapon of Bloodborne. I remember vividly my enthusiasm after defeating the Orphan of Kos, uh, and uh, with my faithful companion that accompanied me through almost the whole game. Purple, if you ever get back to Dark Souls 1, try a Scythe build. I did a Scythe build, uh, I didn't like it though, I don't like the moveset of the Scythe. It's good, but I don't like generally how does it appear. Like I, uh, the, you know uh, how do they say the eye also wants his part. If you, if I don't like what I say, in, uh, what I see in my build, uh, like uh, let's take uh, the mage for example, okay? You literally shoot uh, big spears uh, of uh, crystals at the enemies. You aren't kidding of the two-hour farm. Dark raccoon, I am never joking when I say something. Never. If I say today we're gonna beat Circle. Today, I think we're gonna beat Circle. Thanks for, thanks, for, for, ah, thanks for explaining, man. Love your guide. So you basically made the first game fun for me. Oh, thanks. Uh, you have fun seeing Ireland. Uh, nice. Uh, thank you so much. Where are you from? Uh, can't place the accent. I'm from Italy, uh, your Mundur. I'm from Italy, my friend. And also, me, I, I, I too cannot place my accent. Like a. Uh, I generally don't see in my voice where is the Italian accent. Hi to you beautiful people, I'm going to uh, uh, hit the shits. Good night. Uh, good night, Gabe. Thank you so much for coming, my friend. See ya. La fa polenta fa caldo. Come on. We're only missing like uh, 35 uh, shillings, I think. Uh, we can do this. Uh, we can do this. Italy, yeah. I'm Italian up in a few. Exactly, pizza. There is actually a channel on YouTube that does uh, uh, shorts uh, about Italians uh, and about uh, how uh, people abroad uh, does like pasta or pizza or something. They're pretty, they're pretty fun in my opinion. If you search something like uh, Ita Italy versus uh, USA, you're able to find them easily. They're pretty funny. There are two guys. One is uh, dressed uh, with a blue, uh, with a blue T-shirt. The other one with a white one. They're pretty funny. 
Can you say a sentence in Italian that contains the word tiramisu? I fucking love tiramisu. Okay. Uh, voglio mangiare un tiramisu. <laughs> what is your favorite pizza topping? My favorite pizza topping is uh, salami. Salami. Or uh, pizza kebab. <laughs> But salami is my favorite one. When I want to eat uh, trash, I go with pizza kebab. Otherwise, it's just salami. Yeah, pizza kebab. We literally uh, just killed them. No, he's. We are farming with the pine cone pig. Welcome to stream, by the way. We are farming. A diavola fan. Yeah, I love diavola. The pizza kebab is so is so good in my opinion. Like a. Uh, Oh, Redkinhead! <laughs> 0.6%! As an Italian, what do you think about uh, Hawaii pizza? I generally don't dislike it. Also, um, some days ago I went to a marriage, uh, and during the celebration there was this uh, weird dish. There was like a meat, uh, inside of the meat there was a piece of uh, ananas and gorgonzola. I think it's called gorg gorgonzola even in English. It was fantastic! The ananas has a great potential in dishes. I don't dislike completely the pizza with ananas. I think it's uh, acceptable. Like, uh, sometimes people cannot go over the traditions and just say Bro, bro you're putting ananas on the pizza! No, I don't think it's too bad. Like, uh, if someone enjoys it, that, that's fine. Are you gonna complain about the opinion of another one? Also, as someone uh, who worked at a pizzeria last year, pizza kebab was one of the most common orders. Yeah, of course, it's the best one. <laughs> Why did you post how to fail a marriage on the same day you went to one? Because uh, I just took the opportunity. I also said to the to the, to the the couple that was going to marry, I said to them, you know guys, uh, today, <laughs> since I went to your marriage, I also published a video about how to fail a marriage. <laughs> I thought it was the correct moment to do that. Uh, the perfect moment. Uh, they loved it, by the way. <laughs> they they laughed a lot when I say it. I hope that you did, did a good. Uh, uh, I hope that you did have a good time. I had a fantastic time at the marriage. Absolutely, so socially awkward. No, Gecko. Like, uh, they know I have a YouTube channel. I already talked about them um, uh, to them about it. So it's not really uh, like. Uh, I think you become socially awkward in the moment in which uh, you like uh, say this. Let's let's make this this discussion, guys, because I think this is interesting and I want your opinion. I think uh, something becomes socially awkward in the moment in which you talk about it uh, while not being confident about it. Like, uh, if now I tell you, you you know, guys, uh, I I I like uh, Pocket Cat because um, I think uh, what he does uh, is good and. Uh, and uh, like this. But if I say, guys, uh, I freaking love Pocket Cat because uh, you have no idea. Everything that he does is so perfect. Uh, his characterization is fantastic through the whole game. The whole way you get terrified from it. See, guys, uh, do you see the difference in what I say? Like, uh, when I say it uh, with confidence, uh, I literally see myself uh, that being more confident, I transmit to the other uh, person confidence. Like, uh, when you watch a horror movie, you get terrified. When you watch a boring movie, you get annoyed. When someone talks to you in a not confident way, you feel awkward. That's what I think it is. I think uh, the way you tell the information to a person is really what uh, conveys the correct message. If you, if you say stuff in the correct way, everything can be said. With some limitations, of course, but uh, I'm just doing an example. When you say something stupid with confidence, it doesn't make it less stupid. Uh, Gecko, uh, <laughs> I hate you! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> If you were confidently talking about My Little Pony at the wedding, I bet people would wish you would stop talking. Wait, uh, fading fast, uh, shut up, because uh, My Little Pony, actually, a lot of people may disregard it, uh, but actually My Little Pony has great characterization in his, in his uh, characters. Like, uh, I don't know if you guys watched it, uh, I watched like uh, one season uh, when I was younger, and I freaking love it. Uh, the writing in the show is on fire. You guys have no idea. Thank you so much for the follow, Serge uh, Sergiulino. Thank you so much, my friend. I'm not a brony! <laughs> Saying that the show is well made uh, is not being a brony. <laughs> what do you mean? Everything can be said. Uh, how can I misunderstand this to make it embarrassing? Ah! Whatever. Stop drinking clown, clown juice. For example, here, Gecko, you think you're making me sound socially awkward. You are the social awkward in this uh, situation, Gecko. 
The way I'm reading the room, I heard the most green... Huh? I heard the most green shit said with uh, full confidence and it made it worse. Uh, there, yeah, there is the possibility, that's why I said uh, with some limitations, of course. Uh, but the point is, uh, a lot of things that may result awkward, uh, if said with confidence or whatever, if they're not said in a weird way, actually result positively. Such as this one. Like saying that the marriage, uh, the marriage that they made a video about how to fail a marriage. They're not like gonna say, uh, who is this weird? No, they're gonna laugh about it. They did laugh, they enjoyed it a lot. Also, the, 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 how is it called? Fe Zionis, uh, thank you so much for the five dollars, my friend. Uh, I-W-T-C-I-R-D. Oh, you're doing, <laughs> you're saying something to see if it, if, if it results weird or not. <laughs> it's not gonna work, my friend. Thank you so much, Zionis, I really appreciate it. <laughs> <coughs> okay. <coughs> yeah, I was joking. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> I'm not dying, I'm not dying, no worries. Uh, so what I was saying is, uh, yeah, I'm good, I'm good, no worries, it, it was the water, it was the water. No, no, no need to call the cops, I'm good. <laughs> <sighs> even when I, even when I do the gulp gulp sound uh, uh, near the microphone, uh, the problem is, the point is, uh, if I, if I, if I like went, uh, 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 guys, do you want, do you want to, do you want to hear me drinking? <laughs> <laughs> do you see? This was cringe, this was awkward as hell. But I think in the way which I do normally it isn't, at least it isn't for me. I don't know if for you it is uh, it is uh, weird or not. Do you understand what I mean? <laughs> you just sound like a creep. Exactly! That's the point! The way in which you say stuff is important. You're gonna be clipped so hard. Uh, and whatever, that's gonna happen. They can like take it out of context or something, but uh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> if it was said by a girl, it would be cute, probably. True, like uh, some people may consider that uh, cute. I agree. But still, that wasn't the point that I wanted to make. The point that I wanted to make is uh, everything that you say, if said with a certain inflection, can be can be considered completely differently. Even when you talk on the phone, like uh, you don't have a way to transmit the way in which you are talking. If you say something completely normal, they may think you are uh, you're feeling bad because you don't have the way to express it with the voice tone. Please never do that again. What a terrible thing to be capable of hearing. <laughs> You didn't like it? <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, I'm not gonna do it again. But still, the point stays. Like, uh, everything that you... The vehiculation is the only important thing about uh, communication. I'm studying this also uh, in, a, in a class uh, in university. About, uh, giving, uh, when, uh, about giving feedbacks to people. You have to, you have to follow certain procedures to be, uh, to be, to have the most probabilities of being able to have a good response from the other side. Frap, the amount of out of context things you said is enough to make a whole compilation. If someone wants to make a compilation of the out of context moments, uh, do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna upload it on the main channel, I swear, and I'm gonna credit you. If you want to do a out of context video of like 10 minutes of me saying out of context stuff or something like that, do it. I would love it. Look, a cock. <laughs> it was uh, a cock. Shut up. Uh, what class uh, would uh, would teach uh, in uh, Fjernanger Dungeon Knights? Uh, I would definitely teach uh, uh, a management class, uh, something about uh, teamwork uh, or something like that. Uh, organization in a team. I think. I think that would be the best class in which I could be present on. I just got back, what on earth are we talking about? Uh, no, we're talking... <laughs> we were talking about uh, uh, vehiculation of messages. How a, a phrase can result either weird or good, uh, dependently from the tone of your voice, from the... Uh, sorry, from the way in which you say it, etc. On a random note, I've seen all your scenes uh, uh, of the Olivia run. Now in my head, Olivia canonically speaks like an Italian man, I don't even mind. <laughs> 
Imagine Olivia just going around the dungeon and saying this. Uh, Let me drink a little bit. Is that a challenge, perhaps? Because uh, I have a uh, uni stuff to procrastinate. Uh, to procrastinate? No, don't procrastinate, University Nettle. Please. Uh, I'm gonna feel uh, a little bit sad if you procrast. I know you are saying it as a joke, of course. Uh, but I'm gonna feel very bad if someone procrastinates University to, to do me a favor, so no. Opinions on clopping? What was clopping? I don't remember. What is clopping? Is it related to horses? Clop? Sounds uh, like a, a, a horse sound. Fanger 3 in the present. The pocket cat took the body of a femba. What is clopping, guys? Tell me, I don't know. Good taste for Bill is very cute. What? What are you. What, what happens, guys? Ah! Uh, no, okay, I hate that. I mean, if so if someone likes that, that's fine. But I don't like it. Of course, as I always say, everyone what can do what they want as long as they don't hurt other people. They don't hurt uh, both physically or emotionally. For Polenta farms for two hours while everyone leaves. <laughs> no, already, they already told me destruction, no worries. Someone already told... Uh, I, I did read it, I did read it. What's uh, MLP? What is MLP? I don't know these acronyms uh, in English, actually. I, I'm very like luster on this. The existence of clopping causes me emotional pain. I mean, that's your problem, real, real name, because uh, you, would, uh, you would need a person to stop doing that, but they're not uh, harming you by doing it. Like, uh, it's, uh, it's not the, the type of emotional pain that I'm, that I'm talking about. Oh, MLP is My Little Pony, okay, okay. Yeah, I watched uh, a season of My Little Pony in the past. It's a good show. It's a good show. But I didn't watch it with that intent. Uh, with the intent of becoming uh, 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 a... Whatever that's called. Whatever. Like, uh, also, the, there is a thing... Uh, in Italian, there is a YouTuber that made a video about uh, uh, fanatics. Uh, like, uh, excessive, uh, excessively fanboys of stuff. And uh, he also mentioned brownies. Have you heard of Equestria at War? No, I didn't, uh, Claddy. The only thing I can do now is pre exams are good because I cannot repeat my year. You cannot! Oh! Good luck, Gecko. I really hope they are gonna be good. I really hope for that. What the hell for police a brony? I'm not a brony! Maude Welcome, Maudeduk, by the way! Welcome! I'm not a brony! <laughs> Lo fece lui al tempo. Hi, Maude. You enter in the worst moment possible. I didn't know you- I'm not a brony. Ah! Okay, chat is gaslighting once again. I'm not a brony. <laughs> Maldeduke! Are you gonna do Hol Olivia Wheelchairless, by the way? I'm really curious, are you gonna do Olivia Wheelchairless? Uh, this may be a good opportunity. <laughs> this may be a good oppor opportunity to announce it. I think Olivia Wheelchairless uh, is very- is a very peaceful, uh, peaceful challenge, actually. Also... As long as we, do, as we don't die today, it's probably gonna last a little bit longer. Because in order to be able to get the three effigies and to reach Sergal, we need a lot of time. So today we may stay here longer. Just saying it. Tomorrow morning I don't have lessons in university, so today we can even arrive at 1 in the morning. I don't care! We are gonna defeat Sergal or we are gonna die. If we die, the run ends uh, immediately, and it's gonna continue next time. Otherwise, we are gonna do it! My runs already take way too long because I take how hour long uh, lore breaks. Uh, understandable, your lore video about the Soul for God is fantastic. You and Worm Girl have some of the best lore content in the world, guys. Uh, if you guys like uh, lore on games, uh, you should really check out their content. Uh, Marvel Duke has a whole fucking video about uh, uh, lore of the Soul for God, I freaking love that video. Uh, wheelchairless Olivia would take me six months. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to talk about the lore of the wheelchair. You see, guys, this wheelchair has a, a big lore because it is actually the wheelchair of the Sulfur God. Imagine doing lore. No, I, I'm not qualified enough for doing lore. I did the, the stream with Warm Girl, but that's where my lore knowledge ends. The, the wheelchair is actually the, <laughs> the wheelchair of the Sulfur God. The creator of Black Souls has a Toho series. That's true, that's true. No, lo no, Dark Raccoon, lore doesn't suck. But I I'm not the most qualified person to talk about lore properly. That's why when we, we discuss about lore, I asked Warm Girl to come on the channel. 
But I really appreciate lore in games. Like, uh, I played a lot of games in which lore is the whole core of it. Literally, Black Souls uh, with lore becomes uh, like a 17 head chess battle. Black Souls is so good with the lore. Wheelchair lore is a whole history of how wheelchair was invented, <laughs> including reinvention of a wheel. Alright. How many shillings do we have? I, I lost uh, track of them. 76. We are only missing 23, guys. That means in all this time we, we obtained like uh, half of what we needed. <laughs> Apollo knows his place as the god of skill and luck. You can't master everything. Exactly. Exactly, Nettle. You're exactly right. I'm not gonna be able to get everything. If I try to do everything, I'm only gonna do everything bad. Opinions on uh, shoot game? Okay. Uh, uh oh. Blast me. I don't like first person shooter. I don't like third person shooter. Sometimes I played some of the shooter games in which the screen scrolls horizontally and those are great. For example, I played the Toho uh, embodiment of Scarlet Devil and I enjoyed it a lot. I like gameplay over lore. Uh, I like gameplay over lore. I suck at lore but I am the best Termina players people are saying. Yeah, once I, once I learn about Termina, I'm gonna steal your title. I love uh, Toho. I love the embodiment of Scarlet Devil. I may actually play the other games. Uh. Yeah, I hate first-person shooter. The only okay, okay, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna anger people now. The only time in which I didn't uh, dislike first-person shooter was when I played Doom. I don't know if uh, like uh, I played some first-person shooter, but really, the only time in which I liked it uh, was when I played Doom. Doom is literally the only game that I liked uh, with first-person shooting. Dark Souls is an adventure game, Toho. <laughs> so, like, boomer shooters. Uh, not all of them, only Doom. I tried, like, Spear of Destiny, I think it was called. Which is very similar to Doom, but I didn't like it. Which Doom? The first one. The very first one. I think it was the, the first one, if it, I, uh, at least. No, it wasn't Doom 2. It wasn't Doom 2. It was the, the OG. The OG. You don't hate FPS, you just like good games. Ah! Also, I'm I love a lot watching videos about Doom speedruns. Like a uh, Carl Jobs made a lot of video of videos about uh, Doom speedruns, how to break the game, etc. Uh, uh, cheaters in the Doom speedruns. I love everything about it. Speedruns of Doom, I love them, every single part of them, because uh, it's full of stuff to be able to assure the speedrun was cheated or not. Like, uh, even the input thing, uh, when you click a command on the keyboard, uh, it is actually recorded inside of a folder of the files of Doom. I freaking love all the stuff. Doom is probably my favorite game both... Uh, uh, wait, no, sorry. It's my favorite first-person shooter game, both to play and to watch, we played. Literally. I love it a lot. First person shooter games, uh, uh, oh, oh. Uh, uh, most of the time are too competitive, but true, true, like uh, Fortnite. <clears throat> Can we change the, stre the stream name to Frappolo being based and true for 7 hours? <laughs> that may be an, uh, a name, but for now, today is still the finale. Part 1, maybe, but still the finale. So no, for now it stays. There is a short Toho Metroidvania called Toho Lunar Night. I think you would enjoy it. It is short, six hours or so, but so damn fun. Hmm, I may give it a shot later. Lunar Nights. I may give it a shot. This will take you more than two videos, sadly, but I believe in you. I don't think more than two, Dark Raccoon, because today we are either gonna die as a hero or live long enough to be able to beat uh, the freaking mob, the balance, uh, everyone, basically. Also, we have to start thinking about which villagers we can take. Which villagers can we take, actually? Oh, we can use the sickle villagers. Okay, we should be fine. There is a, a goal inside of the bunker where you where you fight Shagnar. There is a sickle villager inside of the town. I can just kill that one with a, a little bit of help from the goal, potentially. And with the French toss. Let's not forget I have the French toss. Uh, guys, question. Is Shagnar... Yeah, Shagnar is gonna become once again alive if I go down there. But I should be able to juke her. She should have a 10 agility. So I should be fine with uh, Shagnar. 
Hmm. And then I can just escape, just escape through, through rare dimension. There's gonna be a Rodan TL maybe at one point. Uh, but I have uh, both the Drenchtos and I'm gonna have a party member, so I guess I should be fine. Are we going to redo this run with ending A? No destruction. Ending A is not possible without glitches. As, as far as I know. So no, this run is only gonna be ending B. What's your top underrated game recommendation? Top underrated gaming recommendation? That's a difficult question. Let me look at my games for a second. Uh, I'm thinking... Uh, oh, I got it! I got it! Digimon World Next Order, or if you if you like uh, old games, uh, Digimon World One. That's uh, a hell of a grind of a game. But if you are a Digimon fan, or if you just like uh, looking at uh, uh, flashy designs, uh, beautiful colors, etc., those are some great uh, games, very rewarding. There is a video from I think it's called uh, Natfi, uh, in which he does a little uh, overview on Digimon World 1. It's one of my favorite videos about Digimons. I also have some cards of the Digimon card game. The one that is uh, that is coming out now, from the 2020. I love it. I, I love it. I genuinely want to buy some, uh, some cards of Digimon in the future. Some more cards. I bought like one box of Battle of Omni in the past. I have some decent cards. I have like Omnimon, X Antibody or something. But yeah, Digimon has a card game. It came out in 2020, if I remember correctly. If you play Masumod with Abella, Needles will be in Tunnel 7 instead. Beheading Tanaka and he will still be Moonscorched in the museum. Uh -huh. So, Needles is not killing Tanaka by sewing off his head. Hmm. Interesting. You collect Digimon cards? No, I don't collect them, but I want to collect them. I have uh, some of them. I'm not collecting them in this exact moment, but I want to do that. How many shi- uh, Bro. Let me check how many shillings do we have. I can't believe 100 people are just uh, watching uh, farming. Oh, we have only missing 18, guys! Uh, only 18 shillings and then we are good! Uh, I can't believe 100 people are constantly watching me getting uh, money to be able to get a heart, to have a chance uh, to be able to beat, to beat Sergal. You guys are fantastic! How come you can't do ending A or B? You can't do ending A. B is doable from what I know. From what I know, B is absolutely doable. 17! Ending B is not possible without the without the glitch, sadly. Which one, Dark Raccoon? Which glitch? Another shilling! We will see if it's not possible without glitches, Dark Raccoon. Because as far as I know, there are no... Uh, there are no... Uh, not not missable... Like There are no out-of-bounds uh, Moonscourge, we may say. What are you using the glitch for? To reach the... No, the museum is reachable. What are you using the glitch for? Hmm... What... What do you need to use the glitch to get to? Tell me, the, tell me, Raccoon. Uh, why do you need to use the glitch? Against who? And in which zone? Something like that. If it's against the platoon, then don't tell me the zone. Because I don't want to know where is the platoon. Ending AB is possible though, since I was able to do both, but it's not a glitch, it's important to know it's a feature. Uh, I'm not sure if it's a feature. Like, uh, it would work with all the enemies otherwise, it seems strange otherwise. 99 Dumbass is watching men with funny accent play girl with a condition. Because she's a botanist. You guys saying it is a feature? It's badly programmed, sadly. So you think it should work with all the enemies? What do you think it's badly pro What do you mean it's badly programmed? It is a check false. If you win, there is a common event called the Rare Reset. Oh! Then it's a feature. Okay. Then it's a feature. Alright, then I can use it, I guess. Without problems. But still, I'm not gonna go for ending A. I mean, once you do ending B, ending A is not that difficult. Like, a platoon fight is a joke, if you have uh, the, the hardened heart. And also I'm gonna have more party members. Uh, Legard, uh, no, not, not Legard, um, uh, how is it called? Uh, 
logic is even a more joke because uh, you can easily kill it using um, poison or burn or whatever that is. No, I want to do ending B, Dark Raccoon. I think it's more interesting killing all the contestants. I think. Then, uh, if we do that, uh, maybe we can do a spin-off episode in the future in which we do ending A and only ending A. Yeah, I know I could do both. Uh, I need to key I need to save my gasoline canisters in order to do that, though. Logic is burn damage. Yeah, burn. I forgot. I said the poison for a second because I forgot. I like the idea of burning the machine. Imagine if you could poison the machine, though. I mean, it's partially machine, technically. There is also a human component to it, technically. Shilling! If only these were two shillings and the game wasn't bugged. How many do we have? 85! We're only missing 14, guys! 14 shillings! It's more interesting killing all the contestants spends our farming coins. Now they do. If I don't farm coins, I'm not gonna kill any contestants. <laughs> it's that, that's how it works. Also, I already killed the Shagnar. I already killed the Shagnar. The thing about it uh, is the first uh, and a generator is uh, heavily RNG. Two times you got RNG. For what? For um, um, you have to uh, face the owl cultist and then uh, the horse. Uh, I think you have to do that in order to reach the the, the bunker. And then how how do you go back? Horse, then, then our cult is not. How do you go back from the bunker? Polly will die sometime after he finishes farming. Uh, you mean, uh, uh Frapolo? <laughs> you mean Frapolo will die after he finishes farming? Yeah. But does Pankum Pig find everything? Uh, not everything, uh, Zeta Mind. Welcome to stream, by the way. Uh, oh, where does uh, Pankum Pig find everything? I mean, I think he has a secret place uh, hidden somewhere with infinite things. I was doing it uh, four hours without saving and uh, has done two RNGs. Ah, you are crazy. I don't like that. There are so many free games out there that have more content and better quality than games you have to pay for, which is mind blowing. I swear, the best game in the world, in the world, uh, Dwarf Fortress, is just free. I, 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 I saw Dwarf Fortress. I've never actually played it myself, but yeah, it seems pretty good. Also, on the channel, I also have a gameplay of a game that is completely free to play for the moment, uh, which is called The Rusa. And it has some very nice characters, uh, and it seems a decent game for now. It's not the best game, but still, it's free, and uh, it has some good stuff in it. The run took me 11 hours game time, Jesus. I will call it a night. Uh, thank you so much for coming, Destruction. Uh, see ya! What items Spike on Pink can pull out, and is it a general item pool or is it enemy specific? It's not enemy specific, Julia, and uh, generally it can give you infinite healing, infinite mind healing, infinite heads, infinite money. And glass shards, uh, that's the gist of it, uh, basically. There are some uh, little things, but I don't remember them all, unfortunately. Uh, don't you get him from the Vinushka tree? He's a bi oh, where do you get pine config from? Oh, you're, I thought you, I thought you were asking where does pine config uh, gets his stuff from? Yeah, you get him from the the Vinushka tree. Yeah. Uh, which god do you worship if you're given a chance to? Pocket cat. Oh wait, uh, god. Rare, so I can go to Pocket Cat. Infinite heads? Yeah, there is a 0 0.6 chance to get Ratkin head from the, the Pinecomb Pig. Here, Pricket Luck. Thanks, Conductor. Then, now we're gonna get a shilling, right? The next item we're gonna drop is a shilling, right? Uh, wa watch this. With the Pricket Luck, we're gonna get a shi- Bro, with the Pricket Luck, luck we're gonna get a shilling. Tobacco. <laughs> Stop drinking clown juice. Shut up! 106 likes, you're fantastic, guys, you're fantastic. Jesus Christ. Then go and get a Sylvian Circle with him already. <laughs> Imagine this little creature bringing you a whole ass head. <laughs> he does, I mean, uh, Ratkin technically are small heads, so... I guess that's justified? Come on, we are missing like a 10 or something shillings. Uh, this is the moment. Uh, the spam thing thing has, has been going on for like one hour. Let me let me change it. Uh, I want to I want to something I want something else to play. Let's put uh, where where is it? Uh, soundtracks. You're gonna hate me, guys. No, okay, this is the correct one. I thought it was the other one. Fighting in Wonderland, guys. Uh, 
You do not need their luck for shillings, you need their blessing for worse than that. <laughs> I mean, I need the... I need the... I need the luck for shillings. I've discovered that an infinite head carry, but broke my soul after sewing off nine heads. Oh! Which one, Julia? Tell me! Oh, no, I'm not gonna use glitches, no. I'm not gonna use glitches, so whatever. Yeah, this is the Wonderland music from uh, Black Souls. <laughs> Do, do. Also, wait, uh, the music is a little bit low, I think. Okay, increase it a little bit. This is the tea party, guys. Are you ready to go to the tea party? We have to defeat Sergal to reach the tea party. After that, uh, there is the Donovan's house with the Hexen. I need to eat something, I guess. Let's eat some dried meat. Come on. I'm going to Alice. We are going to Alice. Alice is beyond the Sergal. There is just one little circle between us and Alice. Alice is indeed in Donovan's house. What's the title of the music? It's... Uh, uh, you have to write on YouTube Black Souls Wonderland and you're gonna find it. I don't know the, the song this is taken from, but uh, if you write Black Souls Wonderland, you're gonna find it. Which Alice do you all prefer? I prefer uh, Sister Alice, to be honest. Both in her Alice form and in their other form. Alright, then, what idea? 0.01% chance that Pocket Cat shows up instead of Pineco Pig and you get a rare item. Imagine Zeta Mind, I would pay for that. I would pay to have that in the game. Guys, everyone, now, message Orange and tell him on Discord to make this function real. 0.01% chance from the Pineco Pig to get the Pocket Cut instead and get a rare item, please. Stop farming already and get on with it. I don't have 99 shillings, Dark Raccoon, what do you mean? No, okay, it was a joke. Actually, don't actually message Orange about this. I don't want Orange messages on Discord to be full of this stupid stuff. Sorry. Uh, what did I lose? Welcome back, Zeris. Uh, you lost... Uh, uh, wait, uh, I, I can tell you what did you lose. You lost uh, 40 shillings, uh, I think. We are only missing 10 shillings, then we are good. Shilling is 15% chance. So, in 100 attempts, we should be... In 100 Pinecom Pig triggers, we should be over with it. We are over. Come on. It wouldn't be worse than me asking Gorge once about Needle's age. Needle's age?! <laughs> Why did you ask for Needle's age? <laughs> I mean, if he, if he was the Baron Von Dutch, technically he would be like in his 50s or 60s. Uh, come on! No! No! <laughs> I was gonna mess up at this point! Imagine I mess up and I die now, in this moment, like I did previously. Also, I have to be careful once I exit from here, otherwise uh, uh, that mask and uh, the, bell ma the Inquisitor is gonna stop me. Does he know you can get the, the hardened heart from the guy tied to the stump where the mob attack you? N uh, reaching that part uh, is impossible, wheelchair less. Or if it is, uh, I don't want to trigger the mob, Napoleon. I don't want to trigger the mob. That's why I'm doing it this safely. I need 99 shillings for the hardened heart. I'm not taking useless risks. I personally try to be silent because a lot of times when I publish something on social media I get banned by lots of people. What do you publish on social media, Julia, for uh, be being being banned? What, like, uh, 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 what, what do you publish for being banned? Uh, come on, let me drink a little bit. <sighs> I almost finished an another bottle. I should really, I should really stop drinking this much, maybe. But I think it's needed, otherwise I'm just gonna starve to death. Not starve, actually. What is the term for starve, but related to drinking? Shilling! Only missing nine, I think. Only missing nine shillings, then we're good. Come on, 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 come on! They're gay or European on YouTube with Fear and Langer parody, it's great. <laughs> Imagine, like, hmm. That gives me a good idea for a video. Hmm. Hmm, that gives me a good idea for a video sent by the wire. That gives me a good idea. I will think about it. Oh, thirsty, right. Men at the time usually married at 20, women younger. Yeah. If I remember correctly, yeah. 
and that's why what Pocket Cut is doing uh, is somewhat... Uh, no, the, I will not finish the phrase. 20 plus 28 equals 48, yeah, yeah, potentially. No, I didn't say anything, I didn't say anything, what do you mean, guys? I didn't say anything. Nah, 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 oi, why did I move? I didn't want to move. Bro, whatever. Also, they are either they are very slow, or we have a chance to escape when there are two enemies blocking us from Polo. What? What Pocket Cat is doing is terribly wrong and should be condemned. That's what I said, what do you mean? What? Did, did you understand something different? Stream sponsored by water, yes! Uh, Discord mod vibes. <laughs> Technically, I am a Discord mod, mod on my Discord server, so... <laughs> Technically, I am a Discord mod in that sense. Also, we're getting a lot of healing from from this one. Potentially, we may be able to be to complete the whole circle thing without ne even needing to go back and farming for other healing. I've never once seen Pocket Cat do anything wrong. Didn't you? I mean... When he, when he punches the sack in the second game, it's wrong. This is sponsored by none other than Valtail the Enlightened. <laughs> no, wait. For how distorted the Valtail mind was, he wasn't into kids. That's the only thing he didn't do. I think. Let's see. 94, we're missing five shillings, literally. Come on. It's like a 33 pinecone pig triggers, because 15% uh, divided by 3, yeah. Valtel was into... Oh, oh, really? Oh, I didn't remember that, no. Uh, for, uh, forget everything that I said. For a second, I, mis I, I misremember that Valtel was into kids, so... Yeah, everything that Valtel did is also to condemn. Okay. Welcome to the Frappolo 94 stream, the only stream on YouTube that is officially supported by Pocket Cat. Well, Pocket Cat is actually subscribed to my channel. <laughs> also, guys, uh, question. The, that guy, uh, Super Eye Patch Wolf, uh, Super Eye Patch Wolf, uh, wasn't he supposed to play this game on stream? Did he do it? Did he play this game on stream? Because if I remember correctly, he said he was going to play it. Wait until you see what Pocket Cat does to Olivia. <laughs> you missed my, pre my previous message about uh, me getting banned, the one in caps. Uh, oh, I forgot. Uh oh. Felt it was into it. Thirsty like me for a bell. No, I cannot find it. I forgot about that. Wasn't Super High Patch Wolf supposed to Twitch stream? But uh, did he do it? He did on Twitch, he never streams on YouTube. How did it go? What did he do? Tell me guys, I'm very curious because I didn't watch it. Uh, uh, one time I opened his Twitch channel after the video to see if he already did that, but I didn't see the VOD of uh, the Twitch stream. I didn't watch it for gore. Mm. 97! Two shillings, guys. Two freaking shillings. Non-believers in shambles. Valtel is really smart, was he onto something? <laughs> no, but I mean, uh, what did he accomplish in the stream? Did he complete some endings or something? Did the chat spoil stuff? Uh, that's what I what I mean. Don't mess up after this. Yeah, that's gonna be difficult, Puniato, but I'm gonna try. I'm sick of staring at mutated or orphan bats. <laughs> no worries, uh, it's only a matter of seconds. We need the two shillings. How long did he take? Uh, for the shillings, uh, one hour and a half, exactly. If we get them now. I don't I don't know whether it was uh, uh, what I say wrong to get banned. One artist a lot banned me with no warning, another artist a lot said I'm annoying, uh, and their friend group finds me annoying. Uh, they also said there are bandits floating around and I'm, so, and I'm on, uh, in some of them. You? Uh, that's strange. I'm sorry. Come on, we have uh, 98! Last one! Last one, guys! Lucky coin! Come on! Come on! Give me a shilling! Jesus! Shilling! 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 Let's go! 
Let's go immediately. No, no, stop, stop that, stop that. Let's go, Let, let's go. Also, wait, uh, just to be sure, I have to remove the controls that I placed on the keyboard because otherwise I'm gonna randomly, <laughs> randomly click those commands even without wanting to. There is a ghost. Uh, the ghost almost killed me. Okay, we should be fine. Come on. It's time to spend all these goddamn shillings to get our hardened heart. Jesus Christ. Uh. Come on. He stopped. I said uh, I hate women or something and uh, I'm alright. Well, the only thing I did was to say that a female character in a game is evil. Apparently women can't be evil, Mao. <laughs> women can't be evil. No, how dare you saying women can be evil. Shut up, you know nothing. Shut up. <laughs> okay. How do we handle this? Okay, you're gonna, we're gonna craft the last murky vial. Then. Also, let me stop the music. We go serious now. Okay. We discussed, we, we chilled, now we go serious, okay, guys? How do we deal with this? I need to remove the controls. Uh, clear, clear, clear. Perfect. Let's go. All right, here there is the death mask. I mean, it's... Uh oh. Am I blocked? Wait, uh, let's re-enter re once again inside of here. Let's go. Death mask is blocking the way. Matches. We should have time. Epetrolf did not save nor upload the VODs on the stream. Ah, okay. That's unfortunate, I wanted to check it. Okay. We just have to pay attention to not uh, run into the bell, the, the Inquisitor. And there is no Inqui- wh Where is the Death Mask? The De Death Mask? Uh, I mean... I I'm fine with that? De Death Mask? <laughs> <laughs> it's nowhere! It's nowhere! Alright! Alright! Look at it, guys. Oh. Now it's time to farm for uh, five soul stones and three wild daggers. So, let's go for it. Uh, we're gonna do uh, once again with the with the sheriffs. So, it's not gonna take a lot of time. I think it's pretty doable today. And uh, no, okay, guys, um, I'm I'm joking. Don't leave the streams. So now we're actually gonna do stuff. We're gonna fight Father Hugo. No worries. Thanks so much for the follow. Twenty two. I really appreciate it. We cannot save Samurai Senpai, there is no available save spot for now. The whole reason I'm doing this is to get uh, a save spot. And uh, Death Mask! Mm. Okay, Death Mask is bl blocked. Death Mask? Oh, okay. <laughs> for a second, you made me wor You had me worried. Alright. It's time to keep. The harness. Actually, no. Let's uh, let's uh, reach the let's reach the room of the headmaster before uh, keeping the hardened heart. Uh, because if I enter in a battle, I still want to farm. Please don't become a rare BBQ. Farming what now? No, 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 Purpura. Now it's time to kill Father Hugo. It's freaking time. All right. Gold bros are bo are gonna follow us afterwards, but we don't really care about that. Let's jump down. We should be in the new god circle here. Yes! We are indeed into the new god circle. So many heads do we have? Uh, Woodsman and Ratki. Uh, only two. I would want more heads. Uh, which items do I have? Ornamental... Okay. You know what? I'm gonna kill some sheriffs. And specifically the ones in the room where the headmaster is present. Okay, guys? I, I really want some heads. I could farm for a Ratkin head, but that's 0.6%. And I don't think you guys want me... Red Herb! I, I'm gonna use a Murky Vial on the on the, on the the Cherubs. What do you mean? I have the Hardened Heart. I will be fa... Wait. Uh, hardened Heart is not really useful against them. Overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. No, I'll, I'll be fine, guys. No worries. 
if I die against the Sheroops, uh, I'm gonna be so pissed off. So it's a win for you regardless, guys. No worries, guys. Trust me. Trust me. Do you guys trust me? Okay, here there is a Cherub, uh, indeed. Uh, this one is Jukeable. Is it inside of here? It is inside of here, okay. Four ages of modern history, I don't win from you losing this late. I mean... Eh? Will you trap yourself between the chairs? You know what? Since you guys don't trust me, let's just escape. But the, I feel betrayed from you guys. You don't think I'm able to do it. Sylvian! Good job. You don't think I'm able to do it, guys. Also, here maybe we can find some shillings. I always trust you. Ah. You messed up so many times. I mean, it wasn't totally my fault. Okay. It's time. Father Hugo. Father Hugo time. Let's equip the hardened heart for freak's sake. And store the overalls. We are so ready. Let's craft everything I can. Uh, blue vials, or I could use a light blue vial. But I could just make mixed herbs. I need to make... Uh, I have the dark blue roots. I really don't need to make the, the, those ones. I could make a condensed herb, but I think... Hmm... Uh, I think mixed herbs are gonna be fine. Seven mixed herbs. Are they enough to be able to beat Father Hugo? Eight. Eight. <laughs> I got a little bit scared for a second. And let's use a blue herb to regenerate that small amount of health that I don't have. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think it's for the best. I could also use the pep peel and uh, put something else here, but again, in this battle in particular, I don't have anything important. Let's go. Uh, do, I, do I have every, everything? Hard and hard, small things, amulet. Let's put the regen and we are fine. Dark blue root. Let's go. Hello, Father Hugo. We are meeting each other for the last time. Boom. Pyromancy trick. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Fo ah! I didn't burn anything! No! The worst luck now, right? Okay. Let's use the extra turn to burn the torso. Was it burnt now? No! Uh oh. This is bad. Am I really gonna lose to RNG? Permancy trick, 33 damage, 32 damage. Yeah, take off your clothes. I think he's not gonna deal. Hmm. Let's try once again with the murky vial. Okay. I think the best option we have is using a mixed herb and praying one single pyromancy trick doesn't deal more than 100 damage. What do you think, guys? I think that's the best option. What? What? Did I, did I burn him now? I still didn't burn him! Yeah, let's pray. Mixed herbs. No!
So, let's come down. Not everything is lost. Not everything is lost. No, 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 rage quit. Not everything is lost. How do we do this? We have to farm once again. Hmm. I'm okay, I'm okay, guys, no worries. It was not intentional, but uh, I'm okay. So, how do we do this? Let's let's go there once again for now. For once again, really? Gekko, I didn't say anything. What do you mean? I didn't say anything. Calm down. Don't be so negative. Uh, I am the one that is farming. If you don't want to watch it, you can you can you can leave. I mean, I am the one that is <laughs> that is doing the farming. Messes up on purpose, guys. Uh, he didn't want to have the run be over in like an hour. <laughs> no, I didn't. Absolutely, no, no. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't make it. Uh, no, absolutely. I messed up on purpose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw Father Hugo needed the help. Hmm. How do we do this? We got a ve like. A, what is the chance of not putting a, a fire on the enemy with the th one murky vial and also um, a freaking ornament lantern? I'm just saying uh, the bug fix stream is getting postponed. No. Hmm. How did Father Hugo do 99 damage in one hit? It's the combination of Scorched Earth and uh, Panphobia. I think that's the reason. Italian man to his wife in uh, 1506 after losing all these crops. <laughs> so... How do I do this? This is so difficult. You know what? I could just go for the Hardened Heart and do not care about the small things amulet, honestly. I mean, it's no, it's gonna be a pain. It's gonna be so bad. Hmm. I really, I don't want to do it on stream, at least, the whole farming. I don't want to do it once again on the stream. Hmm. I still need a way to juke the enemies and to reach him, and I still need the healing items. No, like, uh, I still need the healing items. Uh, I don't have healing items, even if I take the Ardent Heart. Yeah, I do need the Small Things Amulet. I do need those. Mm. <laughs> Are we gonna farm once again 99 shillings? With only one running is still 75% chance. I mean, that's not ideal, though. Like, every time I have 25% chance of instantly dying. We can farm again together the power of friendship. I need a solution to this. I need a genuine solution. There are the balance uh, in, the, in the way that goes to the moldy apartments. Hmm... Uh, for ages of modern history, no RNG farm to get uh, rid of the RNG. <laughs> Blue herb, a piece of chalk. Come on! Gecko, you just said it's like filling a double coin flip. Did you see? In this moment, I would have died. Did you see that? <laughs> have you tried cheating off stream? Cheating? No. Why would I cheat? Skilly show. <laughs> Hmm. I need a way to deal to do this. Uh, like I need to finish this today. Also, wait, I didn't get shillings. Uh, I didn't. I only have forty nine. Ah, uh, no, a reset. A reset. A reset. Hmm. Pago Pig is not cheating, Jacko. Shut up. How? Hmm. I'm starting to feel a little bit demotivated, you know. A little bit, just a little bit, a teeny tiny bit. Because it's it's doable. I just got the worst RNG possible on freaking Father Hugo. 
You can do it. Uh, Jacko? It's the first time you say you can do it. Oh. Uh, I sound demoralized. Mm. Gecko is angry because you keep saying his name wrong. Sometimes I I mis I mean I mispronounce his name, that's correct. <laughs> Father Hugo more like Farter Hugo. <laughs> Even Gecko believes. Uh. Guys. I said today we were gonna beat Sergal and we are gonna beat Sergal for freaking Jesus we are gonna beat Sergal I don't care I'm gonna get all the shillings needed also let's do a little bit of, uh, of reasoning guys let's do a little bit of reasoning okay let's start to think about a strategy for later because at this point uh, beating, uh, beating um, uh, Father Hugo is not really a problem now I just died to him but uh, it's not a problem I just got the worst RNG possible what do we get? Necromancy. Necromancy is the only thing important. Six hour farms, here we go. I'm gonna farm so badly. But if I get good RNG for, for this one, you just have to cut one arm for, for Sergal, it's not that bad. Yeah, the, the problem is if, if um, Sergal is gonna be able to deal <clears throat> 99 damage with one hit. So I actually need a way to tank the damage with someone else such as Ghost. Chill, uh, chill, chilling, sir. That's good. Farm after Hugo. The problem is I don't have enough healing items to be able to even defeat Hugo in this exact moment of time. Oh, so you're saying uh, farm, uh, defeat Hugo, then, then farm to get the hardened heart. I could do that. Chapter of Rare. Or I could just fight Sergal without having the hardened heart. It's a suicide, but uh, it's a possibility. Stat Helm, that's good. That's even better than this one, right? Uh, 94, 94, 94. This one doesn't state what it does. Uh, but I guess it's, yeah, because it's just magical stuff, okay. Do you like Sergal? I know a lot of people, uh, me included, consider him a little cringy. No, I like it, like a... Uh, I like the inclusion of Sergal in the game. I like it, uh, generally. Uh, Gekko is lizard man, he's gonna skin you alive! <laughs> so guys, uh, tell me one thing. Uh, how do I reach the guaranteed hardened heart? Because I don't remember where is it. I think it's impossible to reach him, but I think at this point I should, I should just try for it. What's the longest frap farmed for in all stream? Uh, four, four hours in Ragnavaldor as ending item only, I think. South of Apartments. Ah, it's not reachable. It's not reachable then. I'm highly worried it's not reachable. And, uh, hey! Fading Fast, thank you so much for the five uh, pounds, I think they're called. Uh, thank you so much, here is an overpriced coffee to take the edge off. Keep going, baby. Thank you so much, Fading Fast. I really appreciate it. We can do it. We can freaking do it. I'm not gonna be demoralized by these stupid morons that are just gonna try to make me lose the day. No. Not now. We're gonna get uh, 9 bullets, mushrooms too. If only I could get some shillings from here. Thank you so much, uh, really, fading fast. I'm not getting shillings from the, the crates. Uh, mm. You have to talk to the tied up man through the, the course of 3 days. Uh, oh, he won't have it in Masochist. Okay, okay. Alright, Dr. Kefir sells, uh, and Shmo, thank you so much for the five dollars, you can do it, thank you so much, Shmo, thank you so much, Shmo, I really appreciate it. Did you finish uh, farming and boat hardened? Um, Dark Raccoon, um, mm, you, you missed uh, something. <laughs> you, you missed uh, something, uh, Dark Raccoon. <laughs> you, you, I think, uh, I think, from what you are saying, uh, that you missed a little piece of the stream. Nothing too special, you know. Some 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 things happened. Some some little things. Stealing hard and hard from the giant is possible if you kill Karin. I'm not gonna be able to kill Karin. Okay, guys. I'm. I don't even. I don't think uh, we should start farming again, though. But I, how do I defeat Sergal if I don't farm? Oh, are you leaving, Zionis? Thank you so much for coming, then. 
See ya. Thanks so much for the follow, Jordan Keen. Wait, why do I have 55? Did I not take the other small things amulet? Oh, no, no. Reset. I have an idea. I have an idea, guys. So the problem is for this run, I would need to go all the way down there to the Sigil of Grogroth. Mm. How do I do this? Manning Dreams Flyer. The idea is... Uh, Father Hugo is beatable. Is there something good that can help me from Sylvian? Can I call you to help out? This is insane. Alright! Dark Raccoon, you know what? Special guest in this moment. Dark Raccoon. Dark freaking Raccoon. I don't know how much you will be able to help me. Also remember, I still have to manage the chat, so sometimes I may just stop talking to you, I'm sorry. Welcome to stream, my friend. Hel Hello there? Wait, uh, uh, wait, uh, uh, let me see. Try to talk. Uh, now I need to put you on the thing. Wait a second. Uh, properties, uh, Dark Raccoon. Alright, try to talk now. Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, I can so hear you. Alright, uh, tell me. Okay, uh, so... You need to have two murky vials, okay? I can get them, yeah. Alright, I will wait until you get two murky vials, and then I will continue guiding you. Oh, so you're just gonna stay here silently like a creep person? I am, I'm helping, I'm helping. You're very dumb. And I'm helping. I wanna help you, you know? Take back the very dumb part, or I'm gonna kill you. Okay, you are slightly not awake at the moment, so I will help you out. Okay, I like how you say it now. All right. Hey. So, wait, but uh, do, do you really know out of strats on this? You told me Rupa and uh, Percy carried you. Yes, make, they did carry me. Make a There's a lot of things chat. that I could not have helped uh, understood about it, and they helped me out a lot. Rupa helped me out from Moon Scorching two times, and Percy helped me out with one tip very important. All right. About movement tech. Cooked. So having people, having people here while doing this challenge is very important because you would know everything. I have like 70 playthroughs of this game and I speed run this game. And I don't know anything. Everything. I mean, sorry. All right. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Flex your playthroughs of Termina. So uh, the point that I want to bring up is uh, what is the strategy that you adopted for Father Hugo? Okay. Would you like me to tell you right now or when you get there? Tell me where, right now, I'm curious. Okay, so the first turn... Uh, wait, 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 question. Do I get the Hardened Heart or the Small Things Amulet? I guess the Small Things Amulet, right? You don't need anything. Um, okay. You need one pep pill. I don't have pep If you don't pill. have money. Okay, so you need to have 16 agility then. Usually you would have a pep pill by this point. Do I already use them, one Sorry. for Moonless and one for Shagnar. Okay, uh... Should we start talking about Frabolo Femboy again? SHUT UP! <laughs> Dark Raccoon Why are Giga. they talking about Frabolo Femboy stuff? They, oh, they're they? saying you're a Giga Chad. Thank you so much for the follow, Terence Van Lyadem. <laughs> Thank you so much, my friend. Alright. Uh, tell me what we have to do with the Murky Vials and the Pep Peel. Yeah, tell me. Okay, so when you have... You need for... For the fight for... Father Hugo, you need to have an extra turn. That is important. You know this already. Right? Yes. Okay. So, the reason why you get there with an extra turn, either with pep pills or a small thing, uh, is because when Father Hugo uh, casts Moon Scorched Earth, uh, Scorched the Earth, damage sorry, of fire damage increases. The yeah. damage of Murky Vile increases. And two Murky Vials is enough to one shot him. Did you know this? To our shot to the, the, the head. Yes, and then he dies. The head has uh, evasion. The head will not miss as long as you believe in my strategy. Bro, your strategy is literally Lamau RNG. I mean, I finished Wilcherless Olivia. Shut up. DNA. How much time did you spend safe scamming against Father Hugo? 
Well, fi uh, what, what, saves coming? No, no, it was, it's usually my first try. Like, that's not a problem. I have to farm for a murky I vial, I don't have two murky vials, so I have to save scum. Well, you can get them from Pinecom Pick, right? Like, you've been farming, so that's easy to get. You'll get it, right? Yeah, it is easy. I still need to farm, though, between uh, each attempt. Hey. And if I miss the head, I will feel very pissed off. You will not miss. Listen for a volume. If you miss... You are deleting like... your channel. You are deleting your channel, okay? I am not deleting my channel. What do you mean? Okay, we, we settled it. If, if I miss, you are deleting your channel. Okay. So, uh... Yeah. No? I mean, no. Uh, yes. I, I haven't even been approved by YouTube. I'm like, what? what? Yeah, exactly. It's, like it's the gonna, best moment. I feel like they're going to delete my channel this point because it's, they've been taking like two, two months. Or no, no worries. They just take a lot of time because they're stupid. Raccoon is the sane. Man. Raccoon is the sanest of the two. What do you mean, Scarf? <laughs> <laughs> Raccoon is not the If you think Raccoon is the sanest of the two, I'm sorry. <laughs> you are misguided. You are misguided, my friend. Listen to the furry. Uh, also, Raccoon, can we talk about this? Uh, about what? You exactly. hate... Do, do you like furries? No, I hate it. But you Why? are a furry. What do you mean? You are literally a raccoon. I mean, I'm, I'm a raccoon, yes, but... What's that about me, Unifer? I mean, uh, you hate what you are? I mean, do you like men? Yes. Also, you are a man, therefore you like men. Is that how it works? Yes, I like men a lot. That sounds interesting. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good combo. <laughs> Alright, so it's time for... I just need the, the murky... Wait. Uh, I need to arrive at the end of the turn in which Moon Scor uh, Scorched Earth happens, right? Yes. Well, as soon as Moon Scorched Earth happens, you need to mur double murky vial. You don't have any other choice. You've been guarding, however. I don't know how, but you've been guarding the damage from Combustion. Guard and combustion does less like, damage. Does less damage combustion. That's why. I have not been able to survive that. I don't know how you're surviving that. I'm uh, guessing it is the winged uh, necklace that is helping a lot. Yeah, winged necklace. No, wait, no, no, no. In previous attempts, it is the 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 cloves from uh, Abella. Cloves from Abella oh, reduces yeah, fire that's, damage. That's why I never I never killed Abella. That's why because I never went Chagner first. Uh, I think the only one who went Chagner first which was actually Percy. Percy. Uh, yes, no, I, I, yeah, it's, it's, it's someone who streams again on yeah, 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 yeah. wheelchair list as well. This is so entertaining. <laughs> really? <laughs> we didn't do anything up to now. What do you mean it's so entertaining? <laughs> Raccoon <laughs> saying they are not furries, like saying that Frapol is not attracted to a living fur, so it. Ah! <laughs> what? What I think to say. I didn't understand, but okay. So, uh, another question. Why does uh, the pocket cat never trigger on the pole? The pocket cat? The pole. You said why does the po why doesn't the pocket cat never trigger the pole? The the the, the pine cone pig. Uh, come on. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> the pocket cat. What are you saying? <laughs> Wait, uh, Gecko gifted me a game uh, and was almost gonna make me <laughs> die against the pole. Thank you so much for gifting me Dragon Age Origins Ultimate Edition, Gecko. Thank you so much, my friend. You almost sabotaged my run. <laughs> <laughs> Because uh, I get the notification of the, the game received. Uh, yellow vial! We don't need to farm! I get the notification nice, of, the game, of the game received. Uh, and so my game stopped working, but thank you so much, Gecko. I really appreciate it. I am not sorry. Okay. No! I blocked me. But uh, I guess it's fine because uh, he moves. Uh, they he... move in a weird manner, so you should be fine. Yeah, I just have to wait, and he's gonna move. Dirty toilet paper. I just need to wait. How do you find yourself in this position that there is a genie with their balls out, their cock out in a way, right? In a corner, while being a wheelchairless person, without legs, I think. Surely is a, a story to, to tell to other people. Surely. Was, yeah, kind of weird. Like, you... you... <laughs> And they're not even moving. Like, they're just watching you. How do we... Oh, static! Oh, static. Oh, oh careful. Oh. I like how there's an emote for static now. That's interesting. It's specifically for this reason, but the pole isn't moving. Do we just die? I think I know how to do this. Uh, press the T 
press T or press M. I didn't press T and I didn't press T and he did it. So I guess he can do it again. Oh. Okay. Like, to, be ah! to, <laughs> to be able to force it, I mean, press T or M. No, oh. wait, I think I realized how to do it. Okay, oh. whatever. Uh, I looked in the upper right corner and then I interacted with the barrel. I don't know if that's the, the thing that works, but uh, whatever. We're fine. Works. We're fine. We're chilling. Okay. To be able to also uh, change the enemy's aggro, it is a glitch in a way. You shouldn't do this, of course. But you can press T or M to force them into another state. What? Sorry? To be able to force the enemy into another state, like losing their aggro, for example, you can press T or M. That seems cheating. Opening yeah. your map. Yeah, that is cheating. Ah, oh, okay. Don't do it. The same. In case you do need to at some point. I'm gonna avoid Just the cheating! <laughs> Do you have a better trap by any chance? No. Okay. <laughs> no! I don't have anything! And I'm also blocked. No, wait. No, okay, I'm not blocked. I'm still blocked, yeah. I'm so blocked. If the other stupid moron turns around. Okay, I'm fine. No! Ah! No! Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> we're fine, we're fine, we are so fine, come on! Okay. We are fu- Uh oh, am I blocked? I'm not blocked! Nice. But uh, how can I leave the place after <laughs> after I defeat Father Hugo? So I will guide you on that as well, later. Don't worry. Okay. Oh, because we are gonna abuse uh, some stuff, okay. He's yes. a masochist, sorry. Okay, uh, let's Remember set up. Remember that you need speed and you need to be fully healed, fully with food as well. Check everything. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god, no, don't do that. <laughs> okay, we are ready. Let me craft the stuff. Murky Vial crafted, Mixed Herbs already crafted. We are fine. I only have uh, one healing item. Is that fine? That should be fine. You usually don't need any healing items. You can actually do this fight without healing. Okay, let's go. Yeah, but they have penphobia. Okay, so I just guard in the normal turn, right? You did right? craft, right? Your Morgy Vials, right? I did, I did, I did, I did, I did, I did, I did. Okay, you need to guard the first turn then. Okay. <clears throat> I should take around 50 damage, if I remember correctly. Oh no, 34. 34. Should I fully heal or... Uh, yeah. Alright, you need to guard again. Again, in the extra turn, huh? Yeah, you don't need to. Well, if you want to heal, go ahead and heal. I wouldn't heal personally, but you can heal if you want. In the extra turn. I, I don't I don't heal in this fight, like I said. I usually save my healing for later. <clears throat> but I don't play with Pango King. Pango King, so I don't know. Mm. What if I set up a gasoline canister? Uh, I don't need it, but if you want to use it, might as well. Just to be, just to be, be sure in case, in case we miss the head. Sure, why not? Gekko is pretending Definitely. you don't trust him? What? Okay. It's time, Father Hugo. It, it is indeed time. Yeah, you should be able to murky vial in the extra turn and murky vial in your Come on. normal turn. Okay, I think... Uh, the, 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 I, I, I dodged the canister, I think. Bro! <laughs> Just like that, that's an easy fight. Like, you don't have to worry about it. Thanks! Just... Thanks! Thanks, Raccoon! Thanks! <laughs> yeah, it's easy. Trust that's the furry! You do it. The guys are saying, that's trust also... the furry, I'm gonna trust you. Uh, it has a very low chance to hit, but if you don't have two murky vials, you can go one murky vial and one ornamental lantern to the head. Oh, I didn't have even, uh, even all of the, uh, I thought about it, uh, but I guess the canister was better. I, I defeated it with the, de with the canister damage, by the way, so I think it worked. No, okay. no, no. Uh, the reason why you defeated it with the canister damage is because the head cannot explode, as the head cannot be removed without the canister being there. Because ah, okay, Because the okay. damage was high lap stacked, so you did defeating with the murky Val, you just added more overkill damage. To okay. It. So right now here with the Seraphs, this is where it gets hard for you because you didn't have a bear trap, nor you did have uh, another murky vial. You can farm another one if you want. But the way to do this is that you go up, 
on the left where there's the Sylvian circle and you go up and down, up and down, up and down until they lose aggro of you and they go to the right. You can also do what Percy did, which going to the bottom left of the screen in the in the in the corner. And you should be able to lose their aggro by just being in the corner for like hey, but another one came seconds. back. Yeah, they will be like you need to time it so that when they walk back, you move away from their beast range. This might take you a while. Okay. Is but this usually how is it? I'm this is how I did it. This is how Rupa did it, and this is how Percy does it. Okay, now there is a problem though. Mm. I cannot take the same things you took from the Hexen now. Well, not really. Uh, that was what. That, that's why I was saying before that maybe your run might be not possible without the glitch. But I ever. I, I, I could have taken necromancy. I could take necromancy if I want to. I don't enjoy necromancy. I have Vietnamese flashbacks from using it. Vietnamese I, flashbacks, really? What happened yes, with necromancy? Yes. I did Marina, Pokemon only, which is only allowing my ghouls to attack for the entire playthrough. Mm. And they went for Perkel's legs for an entire. entire ah! Time. And they, those legs were really, really strong. And I was there for like an hour. When I did uh, the legs. when I did Pokemon only on the first game, no, they're gonna block me. Mm, okay, we're fine. We're take fine. It we're fine. We're yeah, fine. Take we're it fine. Easy. Don't need to push it. Just make sure that you are the one making the move, not them. Yeah. If you if you get if you get into a fight, they will stand still, and you can actually usually get to their back, and that will cause them to lose their aggro on you because they don't see you. Yeah. Just don't get into a place like between the chairs, because that is what's gonna get you. True. Soft yeah, don't be an idiot. <laughs> Walk don't. away from that place. Just don't be an idiot. No! I think I blocked me. No, no, you're okay, I think. Yeah, you're okay, you're okay. How am I okay? Mm. Oh, okay, I guess uh, like this. Yeah. Mm. He was gay? Who is gay? Oh, yeah, take it easy slowly. Uh, yes. Uh, wait, I think I can exit from the room. Okay. Now, uh... Yes. I don't have affinity with Grogroth in this exact moment. Should I go back and take it and then go back here? What is your strategy right now? And I will tell you if it works or not. Take as many party members as possible to be able to defeat the mob. Then take all the effigies, defeat Sergal and save. So you're gonna fight the mob with three ghouls, is what you're saying? Uh, yes. The, uh, the three ghouls uh, and a dream. Do you think that's gonna be working as intended? Yeah, I think uh, the more party members I have, uh, the more dispersive their attacks are gonna be. Even if ghouls dies, I don't care. I just want to stay alive myself. Where is your damage coming from against an enemy that has 3k damage? Gasoline canister I mean, HP, and murky vials. So how much does gasoline canister do in damage against the mob? Uh, percentage damage, you mean? Like, no, no, no. There's no percentage damage, uh, it's going to be only 100 per turn. Remember that. You know this, right? Yes. Sir. 100 damage per turn. Okay. So you need 30 turns where you can do... Well, you can survive, right? Yeah, or if it I can. Works for you, it could work. Like uh, yeah. another thing that I could do is just um, stun them to death with branch toss. I mean, maybe. But the thing about it, like I said before, if you are using range toss and you aren't guarding, because when you equip your wrench again, you're not guarding, and if the guy with the critical shot hits you, you're gonna take 140 damage. And that's where why I have uh, three uh, three other party members. All right, so let's say that it happens three times and that the enemy hits and one shots the three goals. What's, what's going to happen next? GG. What, what is your plan then? GG. You lose? Yes, sir. But Probably you gotta go for next. the win, probably. For the? Win. You yeah, win. Uh, so tell me your strategy at this point. <laughs> is it much, it's, it's much better if you tell me 
like your strategies and I tell you if it works or not. I don't want to like, you know, guide you with my strategy that I won the game with, right? So you think necromancy and um, uh, range toss is not a good strategy? The thing about it is that range toss, while it is really good, the thing that you lose your extra turn, as well as that you lose uh, the ability to guard, really uh, hinders this. Exactly, right? Speaking of which, if you have uh, party members, you cannot run away anymore. True, but in fact I count to uh, give up on them after they defeat the mob. Yeah, I know, but the death mass that is outside this place will... Well, not really this place. If you're gonna get the, uh, the minions from town, right? The old town. Exactly. So there has to be like something that will prevent you from fighting. Right? There will be something that will be waiting for you nah. that might be too difficult that you, you, you want to run away but you can't, right? I don't think so, honestly. Also, what can I do with the headmaster key? People were you mentioning... Open the door that you opened. No, people were mentioning now. a, a also, Ouija board. There's a Ouija board on the bottom floor going to the right. How does it work? Uh, what, what can I get with it? Uh, useful stuff or... Uh... <clears throat> I I believe you can get a ring of wraith with that kind of tier. Mm. I know about it. I never used it because I don't like it. I feel like it's dumb. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. But I don't Luigi like board. it. I... So question: Do but... you think I should interact with the the hexen in this exact moment or no? What's your plan? And I will tell you yes or no. Uh, I mean, I only have two soul stones. Okay. What are you gonna get? Branch Toss uh, is a staple in this moment, so I can actually defeat some enemies. Well, Rupa used a Range Toss and he had a lot of fans, so maybe. Hmm. What else? With only two souls, I would have, I would have taken Necromancy, but you, you're saying uh, Necromancy and Branch Toss is a death against uh, mob. Yeah, it's kind of hard to be honest. Mm. It's really hard. Like I said before, maybe you can use a Ouija board if you want to get a Ring of Wraith. Might help. You're still gonna get one shot, but it helped me with my one agility run that I did. That was a bitch. Without a, without Ring of Wraith, the one agility run would not be possible. So the way I see it is that your strategy could work here. Also, you said that you were going to use um minions right but you don't have grogoroth right now yeah i don't have grogoroth i could have Is taken him thing? no i could have taken him but i didn't okay so <clears throat> what is your plan now by the way in case you want to have an easier time with the mob you can always take rot rot <clears throat> yeah rot Rot doesn't stop them from attacking, though. Would you like me to tell you what Rot does? Rot uh, uh, makes them more vulnerable, like re removes a chunk of their HP or something, you know? Mm -hmm. You know what happens to the chainsaw guy when you rot him? He Will loses you? the chainsaw? Exactly. And then I get one shot uh, and meet Molet. Possibly, but it's a less attack that you gotta worry about. Yeah, but why couldn't I integrate this one with Necromancy? The thing about it is that Necromancy in itself is not enough damage. And it's not enough of a useful thing because you have to go through so much to be able to get Necromancy working. You need to go to the old town again to get the Wait a second. Puniatum, I'm still reading you guys, no worries. Alright, uh, as we were saying, yes. <laughs> <laughs> stop laughing, stop laughing, okay. Pyromancy trick! Pyromancy trick has a very low chance to hit, but it is a really good spell to be able to apply fire on an enemy. It's only to apply fire. If you want it, it's a really good spell. I do have to say that Brutes that Rip is a lot better in this case because of the damage that it does, but Pyromancy trick will help you. Roots that rip is bad there. Eh? The thing about roots that rip is that it. I know it, it has a lot of uh, rev to be able to be used, but pyromancy trick 
has a very high chance to miss. Hmm. Or I can get the rot, uh, but I, I need that uh, something that wrench toss deals damage and stuns. Uh, I need the ut I utility skill. Pyromancy trick. If you want. All right. I already got past credit card info. What? What are you guys talking huh? about? No, the guys are talking about something strange. Uh, yeah, also... I see it. Am I gonna get stunlocked by the stupid morons and the cherubs? No, okay. I'm fine, it seems. Wait till Frap goes down the stairs. No, I already know the, the, the gold bros follow me. But it's not a big deal because they cannot follow me forever. I cannot. I, I don't know how to explain it properly. Uh, you're gonna see, you're gonna see. Okay. Gold Bros is in the front, so the Sheriff shouldn't be a problem anymore. Come on. Yeah, they don't follow forever, Grandma Gunsales. Gunsales, sorry. They're not a big problem, in my opinion. Correct, Dark Raccoon? They're not a big problem. Yeah, they're not a big problem. The only time that it will be a problem is uh, if you don't have the small things having it equipped. Okay. And we do, so... Okay, let's do take this. the FPG. There is one problem, though. How do we deal with Sergal at this, at this point? Well, um... Did you think about that when using your skills, I wonder? The problem is that Vrenstos uh, is only able to stun one arm. Would you like me to tell you how I would deal with Tergal with your build? Yes. Well, first of all, I would guard, because guarding, it seems to lower the damage and also cancel your phobia that you have. So I will guard the first turn. That's why I feel like Panophobia runs are not really that. Good night, Nettle. Oh, good night, Nettle. Thank you so much for coming, my friend. See ya. Like, Shad is yes, going uh... like somebody's intrusive votes. Wait, uh, you said <laughs> guarding removes uh, the, the panphobia? It feels like that, yes. I, You know I don't check on files and anything like that. I know I don't know my own media stuff. But the way I feel it is that guarding removes phobia mm. for the damage wise. Right? Hmm. Is Frap still in the so, orphanage? Yeah, I'm still yeah. in the orphanage. I'm taking, uh, I'm taking the FG Napoleon. So only attacking, only attacking. That's why you can never rush us. Uh, only attacking on your extra turn and guarding in the other one. Maybe you can rush us only one time during your extra turn, but you can never equip it again. Only attacking while it's your extra turn. We allow you to survive panophobia. Which is already death for you. Mm. That's how it feels. That's why I, I, I that's why I always uh, took Panophobia whenever I could in my challenges because it, whenever I have twenty uh, sixteen agility, sorry, I usually have not been killed by a single attack. Oh no, I've been like blocked. Most the... people have. Oh shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Time to deal with them, I guess. Let's try. Maybe if you move to the left, you will not be blocked. Maybe. Uh, uh, uh. Never mind then. I mean, it's my favorite if you kill the guy with the no arms than the guy with the two arms. How do I kill him? The, attack the mouth? So the thing about this guy is that the head will bite you in the second turn. In the second turn. And the... 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 The mouth in the middle will attack you in the second turn as well. So first turn you're safe to do whatever. I would recommend you going for a range toss on the head. If you don't get it, flee the fight. And then I will keep the branch toss, yeah. Oh, the but they're still alive. Yes, but you don't take damage from the way doing this. So I can just you escape. You can now flee the fight. Yeah. Exactly. 
right? That's what you can do against the sheriffs as well. When they put you the bleeding status, you can just leave. Yeah, the, the fight critical state, yeah. Exactly. But uh, there is a problem. How do I deal with the one with the pendulum arms? You don't have to. I do. You're using to... the one on the left as an obstacle for the other one. He will not body block you. Now I attack the, the, the mouth. Well, yes, I think that's how it is. I think that's how they attack. I don't know if they have attack or attack. Boom! Oh no, there's a problem. The, the other one with the pendulum arms is coming. Oh, okay. Yeah, you have a body. You're using the body like a marina skill, which is. um, It's called. Let me see. Warding Sigil. You know about that skill, right? Oh, uh, yeah, the one that creates the, the red thing on the ground. Raccoon. Static. Okay. Uh oh. Purple. <laughs> A glitch raccoon. Okay. <laughs> I love how there's an evil for static, it's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> how do I deal with them though? What do you mean how do you deal with them? You don't have to. You you can stand on the body and prepare yourself for your own movement technique, right? You can move around them. Stand on the body and then wait for the opportunity. You can guarantee that the one at the bottom is not gonna go by triggering a fight with him and then moving right and. Oh, down. okay. I understood. I understood. Yes. Thanks. Yes. This one is fine, but we fast him. Conductor turned into a girl. <laughs> what is happening in the chat? I got distracted one second. <laughs> Conductor is turning into a girl, apparently. Interesting. Okay, here there is a golden. Did you use the golden gates, by the way? Question. A lot of people like using them in speedruns. I feel like they're not well implemented in the game, so I do not use them. Same yeah. with uh, Pinecone Pig. I don't like Pinecone Pig. I don't like Shut them. up. Look at Levi. Look at him go. <laughs> <laughs> the study is now... It's the study that creates now in the raccoon. <laughs> Wait, uh, if, I, if I stun him, he's gonna do nothing, right? Uh, yes, you can actually stun him over and over again. Uh, Levi, Levi. You should be able to. Levi, Le Levi. You have a 95% chance. What the fuck? He's running away from you. <laughs> Jesus. There you go. He got you. Goodbye, Levi. Beep. Boom. And he's stunned. So I can re keep the pipe branch. <laughs> and branch toss the leg because I missed. Wait. In which t if I keep the the item, uh, in which turn uh, is the the thing stopped? What do you mean? In which turn is the thing stopped? What is that supposed to mean? No, wait. Uh, I will explain later. Let me. Okay, I guard because I stupid and attack the, the. Okay, twenty eight damage, whatever. Uh, you can extra always turn... just free the attack, in case you're feeling threatened. Remember so that? extra turn. If I keep an item in the extra turn, what happens? Uh, your extra turn and your normal turn go away. So he's gonna attack once again. Yes, so it's not good. Unless he's stunned. If he's stunned, then you should be fine. A another question. You can also blind him, which is something that Rupa said to me, which is very dumb. Why can't you blind this thing? I don't know. It, uh, you can yeah. rev up a wrench tosser saying, yeah, you can rev up a wrench yes, tosser. Yes, you can rev up, yep. So you can blind, I mean, uh, let's blind him. And if I change the item equipment uh, in the normal turn, what happens? The same thing. You lose your normal turn, but not but... your extra turn. Oh, so it's better keeping in the normal turn. Okay, okay. Yes, exactly. Okay, now I remember. Also... I forgot this part previously. Okay, French toss once again. Boop. Boop. So, Cyrus said you should make a work of helping streamers in Terminal, like for psychological stress stuff. I think I'm okay with helping Frappolo because I like him as a streamer, but I wouldn't Aww. be doing this with everyone. Also, I stream this game as well. I did this challenge. So it's a private a teaching phone. lesson. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. Is it still... Yeah, I, I mostly have my own streams that I gotta keep up, as well as my own YouTube channel, you know? Sorry. They're asking why is he naked? Why is uh, Levi Moon's course naked? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. 
how can we not discern what's ahead on this thing anyway? I mean, technically it makes sense because look at him. It, you cannot understand what is head, what is a rifle, what is everything. Come on. Also, why do I deal less damage with French Toss on Olivia, while Abella does incredible high damage with it? It's Maso mode, Purple. Oh, why. it's Maso mode, okay. Boom! This is why uh, Vela is not that good in Maso mode, sadly. Why she's not top tier. Okay, beats a Levi with the wheelchair. <laughs> okay, now. <laughs> <laughs> Mold the apartments, uh, how do we do it? You have a Steam account for Gift Dragon? Yes, I do. Uh, sorry, Frapol, is it okay if I, I what, share sorry? my Steam? Is it okay if I share my Steam account? Uh, yeah, sure, sure. Okay. So, I don't know if is, is YouTube will allow me to post the link. Uh, technically... It should allow you, I think, uh, try. Let's see. So mostly, I, I'm i okay with playing games. I usually am like super into uh, Fear and Hunger Termina or than any other game. But uh, yeah, I do tend to play weird stuff every now and then. Mostly what I'm wearing right now is not games. It's mostly about waiting for uh, YouTube to verify me on or YouTube. <laughs> because it's been a month and one week. I don't know how you did it, uh, Frapole, but... You just I, need to I wait. I get verified. It, it may require it a, a different... Uh, like, uh, I think it also depends from the amount of videos you have on the channel, because they, from what I understood, they have to manually check them. But I had at the time, I think, uh, four... No, 60 videos when I sent my application. Where is the that death sucks. mask? Why the death, ma the death mask came back inside? Hmm. I... That's interesting. Remember to time it when you go inside, so that yeah, because otherwise uh, they are gonna they're gonna block it me. It actually yeah. happened to me this thing that happened to you, and I was like, "What the fuck? This happened to Frapolu? <laughs> I had to kill it outside of my thing. Okay, I have to take the sewer winch to get a chance. Yes, remember to, do this. to take that. Very important, always. Yeah, I did Let's not go. take it, and I had to do some ninja stuff. Ninja stuff. YouTube is blazed. Uh, is biased against Latinos. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. Like, it's, I've been waiting for like a month and one week because I really do need money. Because Argentina is becoming Venezuela. Mm. But yes, uh, stuff is going down. Let's just say that. I don't want to talk more about the topic, but yeah, sorry. Sure, sure. Who no is worries. the top tier for Massimo? Sari said. Uh, what do you think is the top tier for Apollo? I think um, either Marco, because I know he does tremendously high damage, I think uh, if I understood correctly, it should be like a sort of boss rush uh, thing, uh, like uh, he can deal with bosses very easily. But I think the top tier may be either, I don't know, something particular such as Marina, because she has easy access to poison uh, thing, uh, how is it called? Mm -hmm. uh, and poison uh, is uh, like an AoE poison on all body parts seems fantastic to me. <laughs> Well, the thing about it is that the best character for Maso mode, if you're talking about fighting stuff, should be Olivia. She's the best because of toxicology. Toxicology allows you to not have to worry about anything in the game. Um, the other thing, which is really good, like you said, Marina, you were right. Marina is amazing. Being able to start with Black Orb as soon as you get the Hexen, beautiful. Like Black Orb destroys the game and having the ability to draw for more spells is really good. Um Marco is not top tier, sadly. Mm. He is not. Uh he's really good, but he physical damage is not that good in Maso mode compared to normal mode, which is very and sad. The question about this uh, hmm. uh you know how is it called? The um, like, so the magical damage is not nerfed in Mazamo. That's what you're saying. What do you say? Sorry. You said the physical damage is not good in Mazamo. That means the magical damage is good. Yes, <clears throat> magic damage is not nerfed in Mazamo. Either mirror for God mm. to change it. It's a mirror for God moment, guys. It's a mirror <laughs> yeah. for God moment. But yes, um. 
Yeah. Marco Nobel are, however, super good for first playthroughs. Uh, I mean, yeah, Marco is fantastic, in my opinion. In, in ma not in Masmod, maybe, for what you're saying, but I think Ma Marco, in general, is a very great character. Marco is really good. It's just, I'm talking about, like, top tier without, like, being able to, like, suffer at all. When it comes to playing the game. Bob and Weave of Marco is amazing. Still is amazing. Uh, but the magic is just broken in Masmod. If you play... Also, uh, sorry. No, 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 tell me, tell me. If you play Osa, that is pretty much the easy mode, but you need knowledge with Osa. You cannot play Osa without knowing how to play the game, pretty much. <laughs> Olive is more easy mode in that case. Because um, Osa starts with a small thing, that's why, as well. Bloody James is saying that Marco is top tier due to Steel, and I can agree, I mean, Steel is very good, uh, no? It is good, cool, but it's kind of hard to... get to that point where like it's, it's it's very hard to use marco let's just say that is okay like magic is such a no-brain skill that allows you with to like win any fights like oh. doesn't stand a chance against magic uh, question question is there a way to get a hardened heart in the current moment in which i am hmm. without if farming you, if you want to steal from I don't Marco, have steel. You need to kill Caligula. I don't have steel. If and, you uh... <clears throat> do, you have the save in Old Town available. Qu which save? Sorry. The Old Town save, the one in the house on the left. Uh, in the house on the left. Uh... You know that there's a place where you can draw a uh, Garafia Hunger symbol in Old Town. Oh no, they're blocking me. Uh, I think yes, yes, I know what you're meaning. Uh, I think I have that save file, why? Well, if you could save, you could fight uh, Caligula. And f uh, as far as I know, if you glass shard him, he should be an easy fight. Uh oh, with they fire. blocked me. They keep moving though, so they, they're gonna let you move away. They're not, they don't stand still. That one is standing still! <laughs> <laughs> there is one that is standing still. <laughs> I don't know why that one just is doing that. Bye, conductor. Okay, they're all here. Bye, conductor. Thank you so much for coming. Ah. Okay. And uh, see you later, solo. All right. But still, we still don't have a plan for Sir Gal. Well, you will either. I, I, the, the way I would do it is I would guard. Wait for the two attacks. I would blind, and then I will just pray for RNG. But at that point, you will have a save at the or at the, the at the church, I believe. Unless you used it, then I already you will used have to the go save from at the church. All town, yeah, you will have to go from all town to the church to fight her. You know? So maybe save I already the, used save the save file at the, at the old town. I already used the save file at the, on, the, on the old town. Did you use the save file in? And I, I blocked myself. How do you find yourself in these positions? Hmm. Maybe he's gonna stop. Uh, maybe he's gonna stop. Maybe he's gonna stop, you know? Is there a way to deal with him without uh, becoming blind or something? I don't believe so. He's one of the strongest characters. One game. of the strongest! I... Yeah, you don't fight this thing. Hmm. Use this occasion to farm. I cannot jack. It's a bad idea because uh, in this exact moment we are outside. So we are gonna die. I literally warned you in the orphanage already. <laughs> Mm. Mm, no, uh, I don't know exactly what to do here. Go maybe for the head. Open the menu. Maybe, maybe I don't know. I never went for the head. I think the head has like a thousand HP. Let a me look thousand. it up. Thousand. Let me look it up. I don't want to lie to you. Mm -hmm. uh, what uh, inquisitor? The fuck is this HP? HP wise, three hundred HP actually on the head. Okay. It feels like a thousand. So maybe. 
Ornament Lantern should be able to deal 300 maybe. I think 250. Also, what's the message to you and me for both in the chat? Purpura asking, what's, Purpura the, new, what's uh, the new character that you're most willing to play as? Like, what? Oh. <laughs> Who are the new characters that you're most curious to play as when they release? Well, you tell first. Well, mine's Tanaka. I want to do Tanaka item only. That would be fun. Hey, I want to do Tanaka item only, bro. What? Why? Because I like items, but I think the best card that I want now is Pav. Alright. Alright. Now I want to do it without Pine Compig, of course. Mm -hmm. Ah! Without Pine Compig. Alright. I think it's time to try to, to hit the head with the pipe branch. <laughs> I if think we... there's a way for you to survive this, but it's gonna be hard. Tell me. I'm thinking that maybe... I don't know about this, but I heard that if you open the map menu, or the party talk menu, while you're in front of an enemy, they usually could lose aggro and look away, and walk away from you, but it, it uses the timer. So you have to do it quickly. Listen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to attack the head, and that's it. All right, yeah. Goodbye! As I was saying... Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm. Well, it's time to do Olivia Wilcherless blind. No, don't do it to me. <laughs> no. You know what, Raccoon? Eh. I think for today it's better if we stop here. Okay. Because uh, I need to integrate uh, your strategy with my strategy. So, next time, I'm gonna be farming once again 99 shillings. Okay, that was fun. And I'm gonna integrate that with your Black Vial, uh, Murky Vial plan to defeat Father Hugo. But it's not gonna be tomorrow. Tomorrow there is Fear and Hunger back fixing stream. I generally want to chill for a bit. But thank you so much for your participation, Dark Raccoon. Remember guys, Dark Raccoon streams uh, challenges on Termina specifically, usually. Sometimes he streams a blind cassette, which is a new game. That, uh, it's really nice and it has a lot of, a lot of uh, charm charming characters. And uh, he also makes some videos about Termina. He made a clickbait video on the Super <laughs> Patch Wolf video. Uh, I mean... <laughs> it we actually have... got 50k views, I don't know how. <laughs> because, be, be, because everyone watched Super Eye Patch Wolf video and thought, what is inside the hat? <laughs> of course they were yeah. gonna check that! <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, thank you so much for coming here, thank you so much for the help. I'm gonna make good use of your strategies next time, I swear. Oh, of course, yeah, you can do it. Like, you, I can I can be here helping you in case you mess up, because it's a hard strategy. Like I said before, I wasn't able to do it alone. I did it with Rupa and Percy. You don't have to do this alone. It's a hard strategy. Mm. We I will didn't... see. Yeah. But for now, I will see you next time, Raccoon. Now, I'm gonna exit from the Discord call so I can uh, okay. I can also say goodbye to the chat. But thank you so see much for coming. See you soon, coming. guys. Thank you see so ya. much, Alright, guys. For today, that's it. Tomorrow, I think it is tomorrow, yeah? We have the bug fixing stream. After that, we'll think about it. There is still time to think about it. Wish you a great day, yeah. Don't let the pocket cat bite. Next time, I'm gonna have 99 freaking shillings once again. I swear. And you're gonna be able to do everything. Tomorrow, to, the, pre the next time, also let me change the title, I have to put uh, part two, otherwise people are gonna say eh, you, you, you're, It's not the, the real part, the real finale, uh, part one Okay <laughs>
All right, guys. For today, that's it. And I will see you with more farming next time.